Hello, hello. I hope everybody's doing well today. Just kind of making sure everything's working correctly. So far, it looks, it looks pretty good. My camera seems a little bright, though. Does it seem a bit bright? Or am I just going crazy? Let's see. Uh, no, I'm just not used to my background being quite as bright. Because we opened up this space, we moved a bunch of the posters around, so they're not here. Uh, you might be able to see them in the overhead. Uh, no, not quite here. Let me make it so we can. This one. Transform. Let us do a reset. There we go. Oh god, the, that green is so aggressive on this camera. Uh, yeah, you can kind of see it where we move, where we moved everything to. No, oh, this needs some serious color correction. <laughs> Have to worry about that later. For now, I need to make a new town because the last village, uh, they, they, they didn't make it. They didn't make it. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> they just kept dying out. Um, there's been a couple mechanic changes that I wasn't super aware of. So I think it's better just to start fresh. I'm pretty sure I only have one name left in the name picker, but let's go through anyway. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Oh, there. Okay. Okay. So we're going with SimCity. <laughs> I'm gonna need to populate that with just a bunch of stuff. A new start. A fresh start. Do you want to call the city a new start? Because so far I'm going with SimCity just because that's what was in the name picker. <laughs> And how you doing, Wiggles? Hope you're doing well. Okay, now we're doing we're doing a quick pause so we can get things set up. First things first. Market's not treating you well tonight. That's unfortunate. I'm sorry to hear that. I also made a color change on my monitor, and the colors are just popping way more now, which is real nice. It makes like there's zero difference on the stream. It's entirely a setting in the monitor. Um, which I like. <laughs> Just the colors were very, like, they, they weren't muted per se, but, like, I had turned stuff down so the light wasn't quite as aggressive on me um, because certain games were causing an issue like that. Uh, but I didn't have as much front light on me like I do now. So, like, I have a light here and here helping to fix that. So. Uh, let's go for the Lumberjack. The lumberjack can. Excuse me. Storage, let's put a pile. You know what, I'm gonna preemptively put it over here in the corner. Okay, let's get rid of some of this road. We don't need this here. Uh, then I can just take this and pop that out from there instead. Okay, so that gets us one um, set of logs going. Then I need to worry about water and the 
food that we want as well, like some berries. So let's throw down our gather flag. That just flags this whole area. Uh, then for some water. Two pumps is more than enough to get started. Okay, and then we're going to need inventors. Because getting science done is very important to getting this game going. Okay, now that they're all set... Oh, you know what I also forgot? You know what? Well, while they're getting that together, I can start getting their house situation a little bit sorted. Um, let's go with one here, here, and here. Okay. I have a, I have a rationale for why I'm putting them like this. It's because when I can build the taller houses, I'll build them down here and then they can just join onto the road up here. I'm planning for the future. Oh, shoot. The beaver didn't have any trees to cut, so I kind of wasted that first day. That's okay, you know, everyone's, they're moving in, they're, they're getting familiar with their surroundings. <laughs> okay, and it doesn't hurt to do a couple extra lumberjacks to get us started. Planning? What is that? I I, I don't know. I don't, what's what's this planning thing? I don't do the planning. I, what's this planning? Also, I just noticed that I am once again uh, blocking a little, just a couple things. So I might as well bring myself, you know, down so I'm not blocking stuff. When I click into here, you can see everything now. Okay, you store logs perfect yes I know you're thirsty um oh perfect okay uh I I this one oh you know what I'm gonna say it's important um actually no it's not it's not all that important to get started I think this is secondarily important oh god we are oh god we already have a drought coming in okay um Okay, uh, well, I can build a dam. I need logs for that. Although, yeah, this is, this doesn't work super well because of this over here. That's okay. I know, right? Okay, okay, okay. They're getting they're getting their drinks. One one barrel will be enough for now, I'm hoping. Perfect. Okay, well we can use two more builders. Okay, I'm going to go to normal speed while I kind of decide. Well, okay, it, yeah, no, no, it will work because this river down, this portion down here will fill up and then we'll have water to last us for th hopefully through the first drought. And then that gets us access to this area over here as well. I mean, we can do something. We can build a little crossway over here as well, which we will. Um, and before I forget, we need some storage for stuff. So let's put this here. You store berries. Berries, found them. Excellent. Okay, so we got water coming along. It's not too far. 
Okay, so I'm actually going to increase their work days to 20 hour work days for now. Yeah, this is enough to keep them going right now. Oh, don't worry. Well, well, our beavers will be very happy once we're done. I'm, I'm hoping that, that we get this done in a better order this time. I hate having to work them more, but if we don't, it's not going to get done. As it is, it's looking like I'll need to set up another lumberjack down here. Let's have them cut trees over here. Perfect. Yeah, no available workers, that's fine. Okay, y'all are working through the day, because we got we gotta get this done. That's also why I'm trying to supply some building materials like right here to hopefully Yeah, there we go, speed that up a little bit. I mean, if it's not a terribly long drought, we might be okay, but I'm not, I'm not going to bank on that, you know? Yeah, they ain't going to make it. Okay, it's only a three day drought. Okay, I've had them working too hard as much as I want to keep it going. I, I need I need to let them rest. Nothing in stock. Okay, that's unfortunate. Do we have okay, there is a beaver working it. Okay, I think I can get you guys working now. Whew. Yucky bad water. Okay, so we we kind of knew that that was happening. Okay, let's let's put this one down to just kind of regular. Let's put houses at a higher priority so that our beavers all have a place to sleep as it is i don't think this is actually enough housing um house Demolish this tree, please. It's in my way. Okay, let's flag this as an important build. Uh, I, th I think that we can safely get rid of two of those. We only need one over here right now. We have a second one going on down here. Oh yeah, we're in a drought, but we have level three. Let's go. <laughs> We got three beavers that are still homeless. That's okay. Interesting. I hope everyone's having a wonderful time. Oh, goodness. Oh, no, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Now they are thirsty.
However, they're not like dying of thirst yet. Only some of them have the thirst flag and they only just got it. I think, I think we'll be safe. I think we'll be okay. Minus eight. We went from three to minus eight. Uh... Okay, day one drought is ending. Good. And we have our full <laughs> dam now. I do think I'm going to move this lumberjack over to this side, though. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll do the... Oh, you know what I also need to start doing? I need to get... Um, I need to get berries going. I need a forester. Oh, I can, I can learn forester. Okay, let's go. Okay, now Forester, I did I did like having it over here. Okay, let's put the Forester. I'm thinking here. Oh, excuse me. At least the first one over here. In the meantime, let's grab an efficient farmhouse. It can go there while its partner goes there. Very important. Um, while we're at it, I need to slow things down a bit because I'm going slow. Okay. Oh, did I? I did. Okay. Block myself in here. Just get rid, get get rid of those, please. Okay. Now I'm doing that so I can get the harvester going over here again. down to the left down okay so that'll get us more berries from over there oh you store water i never told you what to put in there that's my bad i'm sorry i'm sorry beavers okay i should probably also put down what crops to plant first and easiest always carrots And then potato, because we'll be making and living off of grilled potatoes for a long time. How far down does this go? Oh, okay, I can go down two more. Perfect. And then I got like this area, which is not hydrated, which kind of sucks, but oh well. Um, potato. Okay. So one is going to be planting. This one's going to be on harvesting detail. Okay. Let's reduce um, the workload here a little bit to free up some workers elsewhere. Manage the beavers. 
Oh, I need planks too. Shoot. Okay, I forgot about that. Um, they get stored in a pile as well. Oh, darn. I didn't leave enough space for it to go here. Oh, shoot. Oh, and we got a drought approaching. That's okay. Well, I mean, it's not really okay, but it is what it is. Okay, there's your house. Okay, so yeah, we'll have a little basin of water this time. It's not as much as I would like to have, but it's at least something, you know? I almost want to get rid of these berries here, but I'll leave it for now. Um, I need to focus on getting a lumber mill together. Let's put the lumber mill. Um, I'm guess. I guess. Wait. Why did you die? Wait. You all are. Y'all are dying of hunger already. Ah, uh, crap. <laughs> um. So here's the thing. <laughs> I'm going to see if we can if we can rescue these two beavers here. Oh uh, no, never mind. I, I I it was too late. One of them already died. And there goes the other one. Oh, Sim City here is not doing too good. Okay, let's load up. Let's load up this save. I didn't realize that no beaver was working the berries. I thought one of them was at least doing berries, you know? It's okay. We'll get we'll get him this time. <laughs> Okay, so why are you all dying of thirst when... Oh, because the did the drought, like, just end? Is that what happened here? Okay. Speed it up. Mark those for super destruction, please. Okay, now let's flag this for water. Okay, flag that as a high priority gig. Now I'm waiting on more research to come through, but that's okay. Um, let's reduce you by one. Now I still need that lumber mill. So yeah, same deal. For right now, I'm gonna put the lumber mill uh, down here. Uh, then we'll take a power wheel and attach it there. My my grand plan is like this is all going to be flooded again, right? Because I, I need that water. Oh, didn't connect that house. Okay, we have berries being collected. We have water being collected. Um, I should get them, uh, making food, though, with farms. That is something that's missing here. Give that a high priority again. Um, and you know what? Let's move where some of this stuff is. I'm actually going to move a bunch of this stuff all together. Um, let's take this here and make a path going through there. 
then we can get rid of this path uh, for now. Um, get rid of these berries for now. Speed that up, please. Okay. I like how I was moving those and then I didn't actually get around to putting down where the farm was going to go. I'm very smart. Okay, honestly, it kind of seems like I want to set up on that side of the farm or set of the thing, but it's fine. Okay, so if I put this here. Again, one is for gathers, one is for plants. Okay. Are y'all still complaining about like being thirsty or something. Well, you're not about to die off, so that's good. Okay, so carrots. Let's start them here-ish. Then lots of potato. Potato is what I want a lot of, at least early on. Uh, we're going to want wheat. I, I kind of slept on the wheat last time and I regretted it. Okay. I think I need another lumberjack again. Oh my goodness. What was what was that? What did I just miss? That was a raid coming in from Kender Frog. Thank you, thank you, Kender. Much appreciated. How are you doing, my friend? Hello. Oh, I'm really bad with name pronunciations. I'm so sorry. Uh, how are you doing, uh, Isu Gaming? Am I close? Uh, and Box, uh, Box Fox. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for the raid, Kender. Ah, oh, nice. I'm I'm very self-conscious when it comes to names because I am a very very bad pronunciator. <laughs> but how are you doing? Thank you again for the raid. Were you playing some some Timberborn? I'm I'm curious. Oh, thank you. My my beavers and I thank you and appreciate it. <laughs> East potato. I'm just in the process of uh, trying to save these guys. So we've entered into a bit of a drought, but that's okay because we have some water retention. Not a lot, but we got some. Ah, oh, shoot. Sounds good. No worries. Okay, very good. We got the planters and now harvesters. Welcome back. Sorry, wasn't expecting you to come back quite so quick. That's my bad. <laughs> well, that's awesome. I'm doing hard mode as well. I didn't play for a couple for a little while. Like I, last time I played was back in May. I went and checked. <laughs> Hey now, we're, we're, hey. No, what you got was a very Canadian, very Canadian stream. Yep, that's su super, super Canadian, eh? <laughs> I 
As a Canadian, I think I'm okay to say that. <laughs> Coming in right before a major update. Yeah, right? Like, when I came back and I saw, like, some of the stuff that we have to do now, it's pretty crazy. Like, the, the bad water? Ne there was no bad water before. Okay, they are... They are... Oh, God. A bunch of them just died of hunger and old age. I have... I have been collecting berries. I'm, I'm getting food planted. <laughs> One of your buddies is Canadian Mountie. Nice. <laughs> and something to work around. It's, it's not the end of the world. It does. It just takes some time to get used to what I need to do to, to work around it. But once I have that figured out, it's fine. And yeah, no hunger deaths is the worst. Oh, the drought hadn't even started yet. I'm stupid. But that's fine. I honestly, this is all I have right now is the dams, and at least this gives me a basin of water to harvest for our five beavers. <laughs> oh wait, you know what? Um, okay, okay, okay. We have a beaver getting water, and we have beavers planting. Um, I'm gonna highlight that as an important job and reduce beavers there. Um. Where is the other beaver working? So we have four beavers. Oh, you're over here. Okay. Well, collect, collect, yeah, collect those berries. <laughs> Because we had some food going, so my hope is that, you know, we have a couple of beavers, and hopefully we can we can get them going. Um, Canadian, you are old age deaths only. Oh, nice. Unmark the berries for destruction. Oh, shoot, you're, you're right, but at the same time, oh, I hate it when I accidentally pushed the button. Um, nobody's working in the center to destroy them anyway, so I'm not going to worry about it right now. This is also why I plant carrots early. Or try to, anyway. Okay, okay, we have our basin. And what this beaver, they're, they're not hungry. All their needs are met. They're totally fine. They're chilling. Um, their hunger isn't horrible. Um, theirs is not looking too good. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of where that's at, but... We got this. We got this. <laughs> I think. Okay. Okay. We got. We got more berry. We got more berry. Let's go. Let's go. And come on, carrots. Come on, carrots. Oh, carrots are very shortly going to be able to be harvested. Let's go. Because once we start getting some carrots. No worries. I'm, I'm not opposed to um, so-called backseat uh, gaming. You know, it, it's all in context. If it's spoilers and a narrative-driven game of, or something, then yeah, you're kind of a jerk. But if it's, you know, advice in a city free builder kind of game like this, then that's just being helpful. Uh, so if you want to, uh, please, I will happily welcome the advice. If you would prefer to hold off and just see how things go, also totally fair. Okay, we have we have five. We we're in the positives, and we have them eating carrots now. So they are getting fed. Hip, hip, hooray. Oh, and they are now reproducing. Perfect. Wait. No, you're... you're no. We're gonna we're gonna have to fact check that. Get, get give me a second. Give me a second to do some fact checking. <laughs> you know what? I confirmed you're right. They do indeed prefer having water and food. 
Who, who would have guessed? You're absolutely correct. That's how you get a happy beaver. <laughs> um, do I have a storeroom for each of the foods? Not yet, Lion. Also, welcome, welcome. I don't have the in individual storerooms going yet, only because I don't have any builder beavers. Uh, we're, we have four beavers at the moment. They just barely managed to not uh, die out. So I am, I am going to start getting that going. Um... But just for context, that's why. <laughs> yeah. And you can also customize the avatar. Um, uh, there's lots of, like, how you see some of them are uh, dressed up in different outfits and costumes and stuff. You can go in there and use uh, and customize your characters however you want. Um, there's a bunch of different uh, things you can use. The mod hammer, the band hammer, is restricted to mods. What can I say? But the rest of it's all freeform, so you can have your own little buddy running down there. Uh, pause some of the lodges so the population doesn't grow too fast. Ooh, that's a good call. That's a good call. I have been burned by that. I like how I paused the one with her living in. <laughs> okay, I'm thinking three homes. Three homes is, is good. Is good. Because, yeah, we already have six with our two beavers. One extra will be good. Nice. <laughs> oh, I see what happened. Now, there are some things that you can do as well. Bots interacting with bots. Madness! I wonder who's gonna win. I wasn't really paying attention. Okay, okay. Oh, Box, you're looking pretty good. You got some high health there, although you did just get beat up there by Lion and Kyle at the same time. Wiggler taking, taking out somebody. Ooh, Wiggler and Box getting into a fight. Wiggler and Box taking down Fat Bot together in a team ba team battle. All bots are destroyed. Prof, ooh, Prof is getting some health. Oh, I think Prof might be taking this one. Box takes out Wiggles. Ooh, it's between Box and Prof now. Oh, the health's on Prof's side, but oh no, oh. Oh, but I th oh, if Box runs to that health, it might be might be in Box's corner. Let's see what happens. Oh, but we got another health. <gasps> but Box turned around before getting the health, and Box did not get the W. I am so sorry. That's a good idea. That's a good call. I'm just so used to making everything in big warehouses. I'm not used to doing anything in small warehouses. <laughs> I'm used to always doing like medium as the smallest. Excuse me. Yeah, I can put that there, but then they're never getting in it. Uh, let's put these here. You never use a large warehouse. Interesting. Because I, I do. I tend to use large warehouse pretty regularly. Carrots. And then this can be potato, which is going to get converted. Then we need to cook it in to make our grilled potato. So let's see. We can build a grill. I kind of like the idea of putting it here. Ah, <laughs> oh, we have the bad. Oh, no, not bad tide. I hate bad tide right now. 
I don't, I don't, I'm not prepared for it. I can't really divert it. Although I just realized I'm putting in like these storage plans, but I don't have any builders or lumberjacks at the moment. Um, okay, I'm thinking let's, let's get our lumberjack going by pausing our berries since we have um, carrots to eat now. I'm not as worried, although I am very worried about um, food. You almost always start with small. The beavers eat and drink breakfast in bedtime. That makes sense. That's good to know. I'm not too sure what to do about this bad tide that's about to mess us up. Oh, we did get a beaver grow up. Let's go. Okay, so I have a builder beaver. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the thing is we now have five beavers. <laughs> okay, we're getting logs. This is, yeah, the logs get stored there. That's fine. I mean, they've already started this one, but no, let's, let's, let's move that down the totem pole of build priority. Um, I'm okay with water dumps. I did, uh, I was interested to find that I'm used to in the prior version before the major update or the last major update, whatever. Um, I would just explode, you know, one small hole, dump the water into it and then have a whole new area to, to fertilize or to plant on. But now I need to make like a bigger water hole, which makes sense, but I don't, but explosives are so far off. I don't really know what else, like where else to put a, wa a water dump. But yeah, this all connects back down there. I mean, I could, I guess, block this off here and then create a reservoir over there. But I need stairs. Yeah, just use levees instead. But I don't have, I don't have levees unlocked. <laughs> I don't have levees and I don't have stairs and I don't have anybody researching them at the moment. <laughs> this, this is our minor problem is that they are um, fighting for their lives. <laughs> Okay, no, does does this like stop getting water when it go when it becomes bad water? Like right now, is this about to become undrinkable? Because it says it slows. Uh nope, not here. Uh and not over here. Okay, it still can pump water a bit. Okay. I mean, I don't have a whole lot of beavers going right now, so um, having even just one is fine. And look, we got we got a huge stockpile of berries as well. Yep, there go there goes a bunch of crops. You're absolutely right. <laughs> Higher percentage of bad water, um, the less it pumps. Okay. Well, it's only a three day bad water and we only have six beavers at the moment. I think I'm going to have to flag one of these as important because we need to start getting research points together. Oh, 
Oh, this this can go. Oh, you okay? If you're already one, if you're only one away, you might as well finish it. One hundred percent. It does nothing. Oh, so right now these are then not doing anything, right? It would be like I might as well just pause that and let it uh, let them do other stuff. Like, you know what? Um, I should have had more of them gathering before this died. That was a dumb, a dumb, dumb on my part. Okay, one is gather, one is plant. Perfect. Yeah, I don't want them going in the water. Um, they can't right now anyway, because I don't have any stairs going down. But that's that is a good a good thing to know. I I that is something I learned the hard way. <laughs> yeah, I do need more water tanks. Um, again, because I only have the one beaver at the moment, it wasn't the biggest priority, or like the handful. Uh, it wasn't the biggest priority. Carrots, potato. And this one is going to be, you guessed it, cooked potato. I guess I should have put this up here instead. And eh, it's fine. You learned others uh, that learned the hard way? That's fair. I'm, I'm the type who I like to get in there and see if I can figure it out and then get frustrated at myself for doing the stupid thing for not knowing any better. <laughs> Okay, why are you just standing there when you have things to build? Oh, I guess you don't have enough uh, building materials. That's fair. Okay, well then let's bring you up to a kind of a medium position. Let's reduce your workload. Um, I I did I learned that actually in my wa my last uh, playthrough. Um, that's actually strategically why I put these here. I'm planning to. Um, cause I did an experiment. I'm going to put a triple lodge here and then my grand plan is this area here is going to be flooded and these will become, um, aqua plants instead of, um, ground plants, I guess. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's flag this one. I'm going to pause this one and we'll increase this one over here. Okay, so we are at eight beavers in counting. I think, I think we're good to turn on another lodge. You can use lodges as levees with a water dump. Oh, really? Oh, so you just build it and... Oh. Oh. Okay. So you're saying... If I put this here... And then did this... And then took a house... like this this then becomes protected basin we're gonna have to see how well this this little tricky trick of yours works okay we got planters and we got gatherers Y'all are getting thirsty again. That's totally fair. I should have both of these as high priority jobs. This is a medium priority as it should be. Um, I think builders is, is a high priority job. I think that's important. Um, our lumberjacks are both high important job. That's fine.
I've got two waters going. I should be, I should have a third uh, on the way, honestly. And now that that's empty, I'm going to get rid of it for just a moment. I guess I didn't need to do that. That Oh, darn it. I was thinking I needed to build across there. I just didn't, I didn't think, I didn't think ahead. That's, that's what I get for being a silly. You know what, I'm actually going to get rid of that one in favor of being able to put like another water pump there. Although the plan is eventually to move them over here. So uh, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna pause that home. We're gonna build them, but then we're gonna pause the homes themselves. I also want to fix my little crop situation right here okay now i only put wheat up there for some reason but let's put wheat all down here all over here this can all be wheat My grill is up here. It just it's in the process of being built. This is where the potatoes uh, this is where all the food gets stored. So it goes from here and is stored up here. It's not the most convenient, but once I get a hauler post going and we have beavers to run those hauler posts. Now a drought I can handle. <laughs> I can't wait to get the floodgate. The floodgate's like one of my favorites. Okay, there we go. Area's all done up. And wait, what do you mean there's nothing to do in range? This area's not flagged for chopping because I'm silly. Um, can you? Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Instead of needing to build a scaffold, I could just make it a one by one storage and just have some kind of like small, well, storage. <laughs> Chop, chop, chop. Okay, so we pause that house. Now I do need the water dump, the fluid dump. Um, yeah, I don't have anywhere close to the research for that. <laughs> it'll it'll come in time. We'll we'll get there. We'll get there. Okay, this is also a very important job. You know, I'm gonna say this is kind of like no, you know, it, it it's it's important. Oh, how did I? I hate it when I accidentally hit Z. Ugh. Okay. Uh, oh, we did get another. We have another adult beaver. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Okay, those beavers are working away. I'm trying to keep infrastructure from this area since I plan to flood it. That's why I'm putting, I'm trying to move like everything up here. Like even eventually these farms are going to go up here. That's a good trick, though. I'm definitely going to keep that in mind.
Okay, and house is built. Perfect. So now this area here is ready to be filled once I can get enough research points, which, oh, who knows when that's going to happen. Um, we had one die of old age, but then we had a couple grow up and a couple be born. Okay. Yeah, we still have room for a house. Excellent. You are going to make grilled potatoes. Okay, they ate all the carrot. That makes sense. Okay, now I, I need, I'm gonna need more inventors when the time comes. So I'm just gonna put these here preemptively. Um, and you know what I just realized I, I can do? Boom. This one here is going to be the grilled potato. Uh, I don't know what this one's going to be just yet. It can be... Oh, you know what this can be? This can be the wheat. Oh, that wheat. That can go there. Bedtime for you. Sounds good. Have a great sleep. Thank you again for hanging out for the... For the raid here you know what i didn't do this before but let me do this now we're gonna give a shout out for you my friend and um we had friends that would push coffee <laughs> you tried anyway my dad nicknamed me Indeed. tree frog so that's what the frog is from um minecraft yeah. always a fun time hey, oh is that minecraft on like 360 or something That's console Minecraft. Yeah. Merry yeah. Christmas, you filthy animals. Nice. I hope you have a wonderful sleep. Thank you again. Nice. My wife and I play uh, play Minecraft together. I it took me forever to get her into it, but <laughs> of course, no worries. Okay, we're just kind of in the process of waiting for the beavers to age up and whatnot. Um, oh, I never noted that these are for Wawa. Okay. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Excuse me, my goodness. Okay, very good. We got lots of logs coming in. We got food coming in. Oh, everything's turning up millhouse. We are having a bit of a long drought, but thankfully this dam is keeping us afloat. Once these are done, we'll then have a place to store this what hair. Perfect. Uh-oh. Um, I'm going to flag you down to medium. One is good. Yeah, two there on high importance is fine. Um, I still only have one beaver, beaver grabbing water. Um, oh, I should make sure these are paused. Uh, I think berry gatherer can be paused. Actually, you know, I'll, I'll just flag them down to a medium. Okay, so that gets us two water pumps at least.
Okay, we got two barrels. Nice. Third barrel will be underway soon, which is the one I already broke because I'm stupid. So I just want to make sure we have our reserves of water. You, you're right, Lion. These berries can definitely go. Um, they're going to ultimately go away. I guess that it doesn't hurt me to just flag them for destruction now. Because long term, they're, we're, we don't really care about them because, yeah, we're, we're going to flood this area. But that's not going to be for a while yet. Okay. Yeah, we're still like a whole house empty. Because I need to start getting these, these inventor points. Okie dokes. I'm going to... A little auto save pause there. I'm just going to run to the washroom real quick. I'm going to let the game keep going since right now we're kind of in that holding pattern where we're just waiting for the beavers to grow up and propagate again since we went down to four beavers. We have not had a total population die out. Um, they just almost completely died out. <laughs> and that's a big difference. <laughs> okay, yeah, like I said, okay, BRB. I'm gonna let these guys go. And I return. Hope y'all are doing well. Okay. Headphones. Haha. -ha. Okay, so we ran out of water. And the crops are not doing too great, but that's okay. That's why they're going around and collecting them. Hmm. I definitely need to get a hauler outpost going. But I need planks for that. <laughs> it's not one thing, it's 20 others. Um, 
let's put up no you know what I don't need that right now that's fine actually okay let's reduce that okay these beavers aren't doing anything right now which is totally fine um, actually, wait, you know what? What if I just pause them for now? Uh, I wasn't trying to click you. I'm so sorry. Okay, so now we got planks getting made. And our beavers are happier. Let's go. Two people may, I mean, that's what you want, Nelson. That's fair. See, these beavers shoot. They, they like moving out, but they also like living together. <laughs> okay, the drought is over. Water is coming back. The lands will grow once more. Oh, we got Inventor Beavers on the go. Let's go. But I don't have anybody in here. Okay, there we go. Now we need that as well for our Forester friend. Who we want... Well, we want one up here, right? I'm thinking right there. Okay, I should also turn these back on. Uh, this one I'm going to have a, as a regular importance for now. But we definitely need to get some of that going. Okay, we are at 9 plus ch 3 children beavers. That's not bad. Oh, we got grilled potatoes getting made. Let's go. Part of me is like, do I really want to put the Forester here? But it's too late. I've already done it. Uh, Gavin, what is this game? This is a city um, builder management style game where you are building out cities uh, for your citizens and making sure all their needs are met. In this game, your citizens just so happen to be beavers. <laughs> But that is, the, that is the game. It is a city management um, builder style game. If you're familiar with like City Skylines uh, or um, like Sin City or anything like that. I'm trying desperately to keep my beavers alive, but they nearly all um, died out because I wasn't paying attention to their um, hunger beat meters and stuff, and I had nobody collecting food. So we went down from like 20 beavers or so, or like 25 um, beavers, to four. <laughs> Okay, we have like almost completely full grilled potatoes, which is awesome because the beavers uh, love eating grilled potatoes. It gets their happiness way up. We got lots of water on, bu on build up. The drought is over. We do have some uh, crops being replanted here that unfortunately died out, but that's okay. Oh yeah, we've got planks. Okay, what else did I want planks for? There was something, ooh, it was the hauler outpost. That's what I wanted planks for. Um. 
Um, yeah, sure. Like that. My village seems small for four. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, it, it, it was pretty biblical. Yeah, it was it was the drought, the great beaver drought of 2023. They didn't think they would make it, but the the last four remember. I don't I don't know where I'm going with this. I'm sorry. <laughs> now here's one of the mechanics of the game: is a drought is in, is approaching, so all the water comes from this source here. And then it flows down, and there's different maps with different originating sources, but they all start at a source and then trickle down across the map. My water trickles, comes down through here, and goes into this little river here. Now, I have a dam here to block off some of this water. Um, I'm working on being able to block off more and keep more water and stuff like that, um, but I needed inventors to start thinking things up, how to do things differently. Uh, we need Beaver Moses. Oh, you're so right. Excuse me, oh my goodness. Now I want to research stairs. So now we know how to make stairs. I know. Such huge technology. Uh, bad water pump, that's not what I'm looking for, it's the fluid dump. So I need 250 research points in order to build this. And we are at 86, 87. It's growing because I have two of them uh, working on it. So we'll get there. Now I can assign different jobs at different priority levels and whatnot. So we can say, you know, this, uh, the water here, it, that's a crazy important job. We always want to have it take place or priority over other jobs. Um, which is true most of the time. Now our population isn't super high and we have some water reserves. So I'm not terribly worried. Um, I'm going to increase our farmer beaver population. Okay. Now the haulers, they, they'll move stuff like from here. Um, if these get full or if these get full, they'll help move things around. Um, the forester, although at the same time, I said I was gonna move that. Oh, well, it's too late now. Um, let's grow some oak. How far out? Okay, over to here. Okay. Contour plowing, save on some water. Exactly. I mean, you know, they, they don't take a whole lot of resources. Um, the drought is just about to hit. Let's see how long this one lasts. Because they vary, you know? Drought started. This is a 10 day drought. It's not the best, but it's not, it, it could have been worse. Okay, I can now research levees. That's not bad. How much for a floodgate? A floodgate is 150. I'm only 20 away. Yeah, we're going to wait for floodgate because floodgate is way better. Like floodgate is, is, is one of the things I'm actually waiting for right now. Although I also need that fluid dump to make my protected water source. Oh, decisions, decisions. Let's see, how are we doing on houses? Are our houses... Okay, our houses are just about full. We do need to start getting bigger houses for them, which this one's also 250. That's a bit of an oof, but that's okay. Okay. 
I only have one research beaver at the moment. I'm not going to get the mini lodge. I'm not a big fan of that one. Okay, 250, or 150, that was, okay, 150 was enough for the floodgate, which I don't really need right now. So I'm going to hold off and let the points keep accruing. Okay, okay, good. We have two, we have two research beavers. A third would be even better. So I'm going to pause our grilled potato factory for now in hopes of getting one of those to be better. I'm gonna pause that water building. Okay, okay, we got, we have more researching. That's good. Oops. <laughs> the beavers do. Now it it is worth noting. I am generally playing on times three speed, um, just to because right now we're in that process of just needing things to kind of ramp up to do the next stuff to start getting everything to build up. This is normal speed for the for the beavers. This is how fast they usually work. And this is how we usually uh, experience them. <laughs> okay, so I finally have stairs. So I'm thinking, oh wait, you know, you know what I could have done? You know what would work? It's kind of dumb that this works. Well, at the same time, it's hilariously dumb. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, this is perfect. Okay, so I'm going to put this... Um, I'm thinking about here-ish. I'm going to take a one by one. Put it here. We're going to take the stairs, put it here, take a path, put it here, take another set of stairs and put it here. And there we go. Now we have a path up to here. <laughs> That's so silly, but at the same time, I love it. No, I want it to come down this side. I, 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 I've decided. This can stay here. This is fine. Uh, once again, take a one by one storage. We're going to place it here. Although I guess I do want to move this one further back. So you go there. Then we take these stairs and, you know, I'm going to put them here. So I guess we need another one by one. I don't know what I was planning to do by doing this. I don't like this. This doesn't really do anything good, but at the same time, I love it. OSHA wouldn't approve. Well, you know, OSHA, um, th they don't exist here in the Beaverdom. Th they're extinct. You see this? This used to be OSHA's headquarters right here. Look at them now. Where did all those regulations get them? A still standing structure after the apocalypse where only the only survivors are beavers. Fine, you make a good point. <laughs> um, what do I want to store in here? I 
I don't really have anything in particular to store in here. Oh, we got more research. Oh, yeah, let's go. Okay, now this was the big thing. Was getting a fluid dump so I could do this. Make sure I'm placing this correctly. Okay. Well, at the same time, I don't really necessarily want to go up there. Um, I can do it just fine going up this way. Nice. Okay. Now we take this water dump. Well, fluid dump, but same thing. It's too far from... What do you mean it's too far from the district? It's right... You're, you're connected. It's too way and cannot be reached by... What do you mean it can't be reached by builders? You're, yes, you can. Oh, it's because this hasn't been fully built yet. Ah, it's because I'm jumping ahead. A society without OSHA. Exactly. <laughs> OSHA who? Uh, I'll just have surplus storage for grilled potatoes. Why not? Okay, so there we are. We're planting. Okay, let's turn this back on. Because then I can get some more trees from over here. Uh, wood, lumberjack. Plop you right there. And there we go, stairs are built, perfect. And then they're on their way with materials for this fluid dump. I never did build a storage pit. Shoot. Um, oh, okay. Our, okay, research. I, for, I almost forgot. Because I need more beavers. Here we go. Big beaver house. This needs a hundred, which honestly we'll get pretty quick. Okay, a day and a half left of this drought. That that's fine. We can we can survive that. Okay, let's move. Yeah, we got one beaver run over here to throw this together. Perfect. Now you can gather our logs. I'm probably going to move where the logs are being gathered, honestly. This is a sentence. It is a sentence. Congratulations. <laughs> The beaver government, well, um, this particular government um, was established by the four surviving beavers of the hard times, where they had to do a little bit of everything. So the beavers are a very self-sufficient um, culture. They, they like to make sure that they can uh, keep themselves afloat. It, 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 it's not quite authoritarian, um, but it is very... Um, if, if you don't learn to swim, you're going to sink. Uh, 
These, the. <laughs> okay, no, no, we can't go that extreme. I was thinking it's like, well, you know, it's it's survival of the fittest. The uh, the most extreme example of that I can think from media right now are the Viltrumites, but Viltrumites uh, are not an aspirational goal. Uh, and if they are, um, go away. <laughs> Oh, right, I never told you where to chop trees. Um, it, uh, I do think... Won't watch out for any suspiciously mustached beavers. No, <laughs> exactly. Um, it is, they, they do seem very, um, word of God kind of thing. Um, so, you know, if, if some, if someone from on high tells them to do something, they, they definitely, uh, seem to fall in line. <laughs> okay, very good. We have water coming back. Now, uh, let me dupe oak. Get rid of these pines. Now up here is where I made my tree farm before. You know what? That could even just be my regular farm. We'll, we'll see how it goes. There we go. So this beaver is now getting water from here to try to fill up this area, basically. One bucket at a time. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea how long that's going to take. I'm also just realizing I probably could have made a little bit more of a direct path right here. Oh, well. I'll do that after. Yeah, ne neither are aspirational goals. <laughs> okay, our population's increasing. I like it. I like it. <laughs> I still love how this beaver is just trying to fill in a lake one bucket at a time. <laughs> there are machines that you can use in the game to make that fat to make it faster and better. Okay, let's get a second worker beaver going. We have a tree planting beaver who is going around planting oak trees, which take forever to grow. But once they do, it is so worth it. Um, I still need a pile for... Oh, wait. Um, you aren't currently storing anything. So I'm going to have you store uh, wheat flour, I guess, once I start making it. Um, oh, yeah. You, I guess you want a road to be able to get in there, huh? Although, you know what? This this is kind of interesting. Go up and over. <laughs> I'm okay with this. Oh no, we have a bad tide on the way. I do not have a good protection for that. Oh, wait. Okay, we're going to normal speed for a second while I get the... Excuse me, I can afford a floodgate. I can even afford a double floodgate. But no, we're going to go for a regular floodgate for now.
Now, um, I want to put this in a way that protects us, essentially. The best spots are up here, but it, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to be able to get there in time. Because I would want one there and one there to protect our little basin. Uh, we need stairs. Like so. Uh, flag this for toppest construction. Exactly. Uh, you're assuming that with the ancient Osha tower, um, it was like a tower of Babel or was from some sort of situation. Yeah, yeah, it's it's the last bastion of the old society um, that managed to make it. And of all things, it was Osha. This this here's the Osha tower, but that brings up the question of what's this tower then? Who 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 is clearly based on the orientation of the tower they're clearly looking and watching osha so so who so who are these who, who are these guys plotting the demand of osha that's the question one step at a time um we'll reinforce the political cultural benefits into this beaver game and make it a metaphor for christianity yeah there you go Okay, I'm also going to have them work like crazy. I am a cruel taskmaster. Those are going to take forever. I don't think we're going to get this built in time. I'm going to try. Um, a beaver society is thriving, but it's only uh, after living with four beavers. Yep, no, there were only four beavers, and then we, got, we achieved a bustling society. Okay, how thirsty? Okay, you're only barely thirsty. You're fine. Yeah, we're definitely not getting this built in time. This bad tide is going to be a bad time. Because it's also going to kill off everything that we have going for us right now. Did you start building the... Oh, okay, you're putting planks in this one. That's fine. For a second, I was like, what are you doing? Also, I do have a lot more logs I can get now. Well, not a lot, but, you know, I can get logs.
Well, I tried. Okay, let's let these beavers basically have a day to sleep. I'm giving them time to rest and recuperate. And see, this is what I wanted to avoid. But I took too long. And you know what? Uh, before I have them running over there trying to build those, I'm going to delete that bridge so that they don't accidentally make themselves super sick. Uh, do I have enough for a platform? I do. So we're going to come over here and do this. Get rid of this part of the road. Oops. I meant to say yes, not a scope. The genetic bottleneck on this population must be terrible. I mean... Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this isn't the greatest. I think we may see a die-off again. I'm not worried about... F okay, maybe I should be a little bit worried about food. Okay, all hands get to... Uh, get to harvesting. I'm gonna pause your building efforts right now, actually in favor of everybody going ham. Yeah, it's because I paused the grill here. I forgot about that. Okay. I'm glad I got them um, collecting the food before it dies. Because that would have been a big problem. <laughs> Block the road, uh, don't let them go there, and stop the dump water. Um, yeah, I mean, I can stop the water. Block which road? Sorry, I, I missed what that was, Lion. I'm so sorry. We don't want them going to, like, what, the water pumps? Okay, we can reduce this one again, since we don't have a whole lot. Three, day, uh, three days for 12 water, I know, right? Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> They're thirsty. <laughs> uh oh. Yeah, this water dump isn't working. I need I need like the proper mechanical pump in order to make this work. How much water did I literally just flush away in, in trying to make that work? I mean, these are getting water. Right, I paused these guys. Forgot I did that. Um, the idea is to do like a flooded back channel. Um, this is way too much space for a little water dump to service. I realized that. It was more just like a test to see what would happen. <laughs> I hope you're all having a wonderful night. 
and also just for those on Twitch, which is you know, I'm doing I'm doing multi streams now that we can do that. Yay! Uh, but those on Twitch, don't forget uh, if you have Prime, you don't need to use it here. I don't expect you to use it here. I'm not doing a shill for that. I'm doing a shill for making sure that you use it because that's a free gift sub that you can give to somebody. So if you haven't, make sure you use it. If you want to use it here, bonus. <laughs> Oops. That was stupid. Okay, I'm going to pause that house. Okay, we have another day. Are we going to see a mass die off? At least we got the potatoes sorted, so they have food. And I think water is still slowly coming out of like not not much and not well. Not gonna work unless you have more water storage, uh, the bigger deposit. Um, yeah. Okay, the drought is over. Hip, or sorry, the bad water is over. Hip, hip, hooray, go away. You see it's, it's rushing out. It's pushing out all the yucky poo poo water. I need it to hurry. Okay, good. Okay, good. You see, it, it, the good water's coming in. Plants are restoring. Water is coming in. Like, at a proper speed now. Oh, heck yeah. We, man we managed to get enough water. We managed to get water in before... A mass die off. Okay, let's get rid of that in favor of this. Okay, one person, we had one beaver just now die of thirst. How tragic. Oh shit, I have them overworking again. That was when I needed them working in here. Okay, let's get them building these again. Now, I really think that these should be the higher ones, but for now, this is fine. This is hopefully fine. Okay, okay, we had one beaver die of thirst, but so far, we seem to be doing okay. Okay, let's turn that back on. Excellent. Perfect. We're preparing for the next bad tide. We're going to block that off. Tide of old age.
Okay, it looks like thirst has largely been quenched. I'm going to need more water production and storage. I don't have gears getting made yet. I still haven't made a pit to store that stuff. What is wrong with me? Um, let's take this here. And then I can move... I can also just move this up here, which will be good. Eventually, I'm going to have like a bunch of windmill production and stuff as well. Uh, windmill is only 120, actually. Let's unlock that real quick. No, I didn't want to build you there, silly. I wanted to build a large pit right here. And what's in this pit? Planks. Okay, y'all are hungry. That's that's valid. That's valid criticism. Let's turn these berry gatherers on and have them gather some supplies. We have a drought approaching. Oh, whoops. Did I? Did I, I could have sworn I labeled this area for... Oh, I labeled that bottom area for cutting. Sitting here waiting for them to start cutting. I'm just going to go around and quickly uh, flag all this for cutting for when I eventually hopefully make my way over here. There we go. Plant some more oak there. Okay. The berries should hopefully be enough to tide us over until more crops come in. Let's see. So we need a grit, a grit smith and a bakery to start making bread. And it's 180 for that. Building lacks power. That's okay. Excellent. Now this can just be open for now. It doesn't have to be anything special. Same deal with this one. Okay, storage is coming along. Nothing to do in range. I mean, that's fair. You're just kind of in a holding pattern down here. So let's get rid of one of you. And the drought has kicked off.
I don't really have a reason for those to be there right now. This one has like a fun little uh, trick is pretty awesome, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, this side is ready to go for when bad water hits. And this side is underway. Although also, since I am... Let's see. Because if I block off this area here, then I can redirect more, more water my way too. There's a lot of floodgates in this level is what I'm saying. Okay. Uh, stairs. Um, let's see. I can't afford that just yet. So scaffolding it is. Okay. Okay, we have our protection almost from bad water. You know what? I'm thinking I might just make like one big basin and like a secondary little thing down here. I'm not too sure yet. We shall see how it goes. Okay, one more log in that one set up. Perfect. Okay, this seems to be working out pretty decently so far. Yep, they're getting this built up. <laughs> Very good. One more, there's last log. Okay, now planks can start being stored up here. Excellent. Okay, this is now ready to go. Yes. The dynamite would make that a lot easier, but dynamite is... Um, harder to obtain now like it's not impossible or anything it's just i need to get uh more materials oh goodness you also have nothing to do okay then go away Go do something else. Be productive. <laughs> this one up here is the one grabbing logs. Okay. Oh, scratchy. Ooh. Okay, we're definitely reaching a point where I need to step up certain productions of stuff. Okay, let's do two of you. It should be all three, really. Okay, I'm going to do three on gathers. I 
I'm also going to make the priority for gathering potato. I think that's the more important thing to be gathering first. Ah, nice. Okay. Once again, I'm going to let that this run. I will be right back.
I return. I hope y'all are doing well. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh my goodness. Okay, so far we seem to be doing okay. The drought is hanging in there. So far, uh, so good. There goes the drought kicking in, but that's okay because we have our reserves. This is fine. The population is growing. We are still collecting everything. The plants shouldn't die out. This, okay, no, the, um, the potatoes are definitely going to dry out. It's a good thing I put the priority on the potato gatherers. So yeah, potatoes dry out really quick. Um, the carrots take a bit longer. The wheat is going to dry out pretty quick. I almost want to save the wheat, but at the same time, we're actively eating the potatoes. So I think that's the better one to save. So much so that before this day ends, I'm going to have you focus on gathering potatoes as well. We might as well get all the potatoes that we can. Okay, do you, did I, I, oh, I already did research the windmill? Oh, I'm so smart, look at me. Um, okay. Part of our problem is we need the water to grow the trees. Um, the trees should grow perfectly fine once we have consistent water. Which is about to happen. I hope. I got floodgates all over the place just waiting to come to life. I'm gonna replace this dam with stilts, but... That, that's a later, that's a later issue. Indeed. Comma. Now what does one mean by just comma, I wonder? <laughs> I'm sorry I'm giving you a hard time, I'm just having fun. <laughs> Okay, the drought has ended. It's gonna take some time for the water to make its way back down here. And there is this little pool of water up here that I always forget about. Okay, we're about to run out of water. That's always fun. Okay, you get to prioritize planting. This one prioritizes gathering. We stop them from eating our raw potato. Exactly. <laughs> if only. <laughs> okay, we got lots of research starting to kick off because we have more beavers starting to populate. Okay, here's that water I was so excited about. Okay, and our floodgate here is almost ready. Almost. I need another um, lumber mill. So I'm gonna put the lumber mill, I'm gonna put two of them here. 
And for now, just to get things started, I'm going to have power wheel, power wheel, T-joint. Um, I wanted the single. There we go. Take the road. There we go. I think I will even go so far as to flag these as a high priority build. <clears throat> oh, look at that. I got beavers looking for jobs now. Perfect. That's what we're hoping for. A drought approaching. Who eats raw potato? Mashed potatoes, fried potato are more delicious. You're absolutely right. Oh, a good mashed potato. Okay, so I'll be able to close this off and give us some uh, safety here. Now, I'm going to go ahead and mark these as negative a tier. Because I want them to build it, but you know, that, that, that comes later. This one I want built pretty soon, but I need um, more planks to make that more efficient. <clears throat> Oh, nice. Didn't realize I could do that. Uh, lumberjack. Okay. District 1, consider optimizing your path. Nope! I stubbornly refuse. Um, now, I did already mark it for tree chopping. I remember doing that. Putting in another one to help out a little more. Now, if I just built straight across, that would definitely be way better. So we'll see about this coming together. speed. Let's close this entirely. Oops. Double oops. Okay, let some of that water out. There we go. Hopefully that's enough. That's why I closed this area off. Okay, so this is now at like max capacity. Hopefully it lasts us the 15 point oof days. Um, ooh, okay, I have enough. Now I'd need that gear storage, but the gear storage we can't do until we have these online.
Now watch, if I open this up, yeah, no water is going to come through because this is all empty. But this isn't. Once I have this, then, then we'll be able to store a lot of water. Now this does... Uh, at least these trees are finally growing. Like, th like some of these are about to pop. And we do have lots of wood around here to gather, so we're, we're not, we're not, we're not at a standstill. We're just almost at a standstill. <laughs> well, so far this is honestly pretty good. I'm okay with this. Working away. <laughs> okay, logs are on their way. Perfect. Oh, they're focusing on the power wheel first. That's fair, I guess. We are inventorating. We are gathering. Things are things are currently in a pretty decent balance so far <laughs> we'll see how well that goes that water is going down a little faster than I would have liked I'm actually a little surprised at how fast it's going down. Okay, with those two done, these will be... Oh god, wait. Uh, pause this one. <laughs> Had I not done that, this one I don't think would have been able to be finished. And then I would have been very sad. Okay. Planks are now getting made. Let's take power, fan. Now I'm gonna have to do like a bridge here, but that's okay. Yeah, this would be where you focused since I did make that the higher priority. For now, though, I want you to build this. Okay, let's mark this as ultra low. I'm going to temporarily mark these as low. And I'll mark these as advanced so that they can get built up first. Well, I guess after this. <clears throat> um, that's just th that road is just temporary because I don't have the bridge yet. So to keep this running at proper efficiency, 
I have a temporary road here that I will just remove once these, once this is built. Because otherwise they just didn't have a way to get to their job. <laughs> that was the main problem. That's, that's a valid question though, 100% valid. See, these are getting, yeah, these already have all their supplies. Someone just has to come by and basically just get, give it give it the inspection. Um, we've already established it's not OSHA, so it's going to be um, whatever the beaver equivalent is. Okay, now that that's done, we can remove this part of the road. Um, we're also going to remove this which might seem a little weird until I put in this four-way so that I can connect that. Um, give that a top priority. With this getting average authority. There we go. I'm going to be maintaining this manual beaver backup just in case because I didn't do that last time and oh, did I regret it. Okay, I have all of this water here just waiting to go back into there. Um, yeah. Um, you know what? Your job gets to be paused. Because I want this water to come back in here. I did say this to get replaced with scaffolding. Is this okay? This is being powered by the windmill now. Excellent. Power connector blocked? That's fine. Oh, heck yeah. Okay, they're nearly done building this. I'll let them finish that off. I'm also going to uh, modify the road ever so slightly because this I'm noticing is a perfect spot for another lumber mill so I can then remove this one and have it be up here instead. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, they built the bridge, perfect. Um, that's already open. Let's open this up for when the drought ends. We got a week left of this drought. Um, well, my, my plan is still to eliminate the stuff from down here. Like the town hall here is probably just going to move like right here. Oh, shoot. One of my posters just fell. Um, I'll have to fix that. <clears throat> but my plan is I want to remove this. Full stop. You know what? I can just do that now. And the district is going to go up here.
I think this can make a good spot. Okay, now this is where things are going to be very confusing for a second. Migrate population. Um, you all live over here now. Okay. Now let's get rid of District 1 in favor of District 2, which now lives up here. Perfect. Minor shuffle while everyone moves around, but everything's basically the same. It's just the town center is up here now instead of down here. And that does mean things are more in different like ranges now, which is pretty awesome. That's why I've been building up the way I have been is because I knew we were going to be ending up like this. Oh God, we're out. Oh God, we're out of water with six days to go. The beavers are doomed. We're dead. <laughs> Although we can make a pilgrimage. We can, we can save them. Uh, this is a bit of a suck, but Okay, let's make, let's mark some priorities. Ultra high, of course. And that should be the only thing being built right now, basically. We can if we can get over there in time then we'll, then we'll be fine um are we out of logs again um okay hmm I never did finish building over there we built over here. I'm seeing if there's anywhere where I can get some more logs. I've already got all that, I thought so. Uh, chop trees, chop all these trees, please. Come on. That's something. Some logs and planks, maybe? If it's as long as it's one log. Oh my god, it was actually one log. Nice, because it's a bunch of things over a bunch of um uh uh planks over there. Okay, now get over here and start chopping your beaver butt off. You know what? Even just to speed things up, I'm going to throw down some more. I know you're thirsty. I'm working on it. Oh, perfect. Okay, so these are ready to go. I need more logs in order to finish it off, which is why I'm building them up like I am. Okay, that's one done. Now for the second one, come on. 
Okay, now, 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 get us some water. Get us some water. Quick, 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 quick. Well, so you know what? Logs are gonna have to get moved. I'm just gonna get rid of that for now. Come on. Six, okay. Oh, this is this is getting really really scary and risky. I know you're thirsty. I'm trying really hard. <laughs> okay, just a couple more. Well, you know what? You're actually you're, you're done for now, bud. You're done, bud. Okay, I think that's enough enough wood. Well, okay, well maybe. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that's enough. Okay, okay, okay. Get up here and 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 get us water, please. <laughs> Okay, that's... Hopefully this is enough to... Oh my goodness. Hey! Final Waltz, thank you, thank you for the raid. Much appreciated. I hope you're doing well. That's, we're we're going to do a shout-out here for you, my friend. How are you doing? Were you playing yourself some Timberborn as well? What do you got going on over here? The beavering is going uh, okay. We're desperately trying to. Oh, are you Appa? Huh, how did I know? How did I know? Before even seeing the hat, I knew you were Appa. And of course. No worries. Thank you for the raid. That's fair. I appreciate that, Bass. <laughs> <They're a riot. laughs> so we, we ran out of water on day with six days left to go in the drought over here. When I remembered we had this little reserve over here, but we also ran out of wood. So I had to basically um, quickly build up a way for that to happen. Thank you, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Oh, I'm really bad with names. I'm so sorry. Uh, Aquashi? Aqu Aqu Aquashi? Aquishi? <laughs> and final, wild. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Rhino, thank you. Uh, my least favorite mechanic in this game or uh, suggest a quality of life. Um hard to say i've only just really gotten back into it um a squishy a qu i am i'm like i said i'm really about names i'm really sorry a squishy <laughs> okay they are still dying i i'm a bunch of them are dying of thirst however it's not going to be a total population wipe since there are some that are while they may not be unthirsty, they are not dying of thirst. So, so we have at least something. I quash, uh, I quash his. Oh yes, I'm bad at that. That's the thing you're supposed to do. Right. Sorry, one second while I lower these down before I forget. Um, not too much to tell. Uh, long time streamer. I've uh, been doing this for, well, since Twitch has been around, honestly. 
Um, that's why I have the my the partner badge is I got in really early, fell off for a little while doing software development, uh, getting back into it in earnest now, doing kind of variety streams, a lot of sim based games, uh, these kind of games. Uh, I'm bad at this. I don't have anything prepared. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Okay, we have water. Perfect. Let's raise this up to 0.5. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the follow, J Bass. <laughs> I need I need some kind of, yeah, I need I need a, a a welcome message and script for when uh, raids and whatnot happen. <laughs> You're absolutely right. Okay, we we've lost We've lost two thirds of the population. We were at 33 beavers. We are down to 11. <laughs> okay, time, time to do um, some uh, control of who is working where so we make sure we have the vitals covered. Okay, water is covered. We have one worker over here, that's fine. Uh, we have somebody doing grills. Perfect. Do we have potatoes? We don't currently have potatoes. Um, so, you know, we're actually going to prioritize the carrot. Just because it grows faster. Uh, let's get this berry back online. Uh, let's turn down our builder beavers to just one. Um, let's see. You don't have anything to do, so let's just get rid of you. We're going to get rid of you. Uh, you get paused because you are emergency reserve backup water. Um, let's see. This one we want to keep because we want these to eventually be uh, farmable. So far, I think it's going pretty good. Oh yeah, you know what? Water tank is a good idea. How are how are all of you doing? How how what is up with your nights? Tell me about all of yourselves. I'm I'm deeply curious. Distract, distract, distract. <laughs> but I am also genuinely curious. Okay, yeah, let's 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 add the gear. We can start working on that, and I will do as you suggested before, Lion. Let's put the gear workshop where these plank, where this plank workshop was. Just got off work. Your life is boring. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that. Getting off work is always a good time. I refuse to say that you're boring. Okay, I'm going to pause these. Because, I mean, they are wind-powered. Um, not that anyone's working them right now anyway. Uh, grilled potato. Uh. Now, this is a very important job, but there isn't anything to harvest from here right now. So I'm going to leave it. Um, let's reduce these to one apiece just to get us started. Uh, we also only really need two of the... I mean, only one of them really needs to be online right now. Um, let's have you... Okay, I do have one coming over here to gather berries already. Perfect. Let's see. So I have a builder. Nice. This is going to store logs. Now, I think that's part of the problem is right now I don't really have the materials to build anything. <laughs> because the water kept running out so I'm waiting on these trees to grow but oh this one's gonna pop soon nice should go on chat GPT and throw something together for a, for a script that is <laughs>
Come on, music, come back. Yay. Usually I have other music playing, but this, this game I really like the ambient music that it uses, so I'd rather stick with it for now. Hey, hey, Fab. How you doing? How are the puppos? How is the new burb? You need to start Timberborn at some point? Oh, it's definitely worth it. Oh, shoot. I do need this to get completed ASAP. Um, you got, you, you got, you got, you got it sitting right here. Okay, I'm going to reduce this down, make it a super priority because I can make them pick up this stuff. Okay. Ninety-nine. Okay, the water. I need. I need to start worrying about uh, saving up water. Okay, I'm going to close this off for now and close this off for now because I want to start building this up. It definitely is an A plus game. I, I agree with you. Uh, I agree with you, Waltz. It's just. It's too good. Oh shoot, right. I'm, oh sh Oh no. Um Oh, I don't like that. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, whoops. Okay. I love how the water like actually flows back and forth in a closed system. I find that to be a really cool little detail. Okay, so my plan here is to basically fill this up as much as I can. Which most of the water is still going to flow out this way, so it's not really going to happen. But, you know, I can, I can dream. Oh, you know what? If I do this... Hold on, because I can close this side off, but then leave like this side open to let the water in is my idea. Okay, let's have this fill up a bit. Okay, that's probably good for right now. I'm trying to create like a two-stage water system. It looks like water's still flowing in through this side, I think. Throw a little bit more into the river down there. And then as soon as the drought hits, we're locking this door. Okay. The drought has started. We are sitting on a 20 on a on an 18 day drought. But so far, so good. Okay, we have logs. Perfect. What the? No! Why are you open? I closed you! Oh, I'm so annoyed right now. That is so frustrating. Y'all saw me close it, right? Like, it was definitely closed. Ah! <laughs> oh, well. I'd say that, if anything, that's a, a, a bug that kind of annoys me, that for some reason... I'll close it, but it doesn't actually close. Um, 
We haven't had the bad riptide or the bad water in a while, which is also good. I should have double checked. It's my fault for not checking sooner. Oh, it's going to stunt our trees again. We're never going to get trees planted or growing. Like, look, I have a huge forest of dead trees. Okay, now we do have we do have less beavers this time than the last drought, so I'm not as worried. Um, it's still just uh, I'm annoyed at myself. Um, oh yeah, um, the the filter seems to be broken on that one for some reason. I need to go in and fix that. Well, sorry, Fab. It's my bad. Let's mark that as a somewhat important job. And of course, right when I do is when the wind stops. I hate everything. <laughs> okay, so they are going over here to build up this one. Perfect. Am I out of logs again? Oh, this, these are gonna take a while to grow yet. This is the problem is that I'll, this will happen is I'll have things going, but then not fully pay attention. Um, and then I don't have any wood and I'm kind of at a standstill while I just wait for trees to grow, <laughs> which is okay. That's, that's just the game. That's fair, Fab. <laughs> Most of the other stuff should work. I've been um, moving everything over into StreamerBot. Um, the, uh, shout out took me quite a while to get ported over properly because I had to build things and, uh, do stuff that otherwise it didn't already otherwise do. Um, although, uh, the effect that took me the longest to get going, which I forgot, which would have been perfect for noticing that this was open. <laughs> I had to do some custom coding to get the right effect for the smoothness of the tilting of, of the rotation and whatnot. But I'm happy with how it turned out. Beavers have grown up. How are you doing? We got 80%, 83%. Can I even open this? Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay, whatever. It's hopefully helping keep some of these trees alive, if nothing else. Big old drought. And I can't even build, like, stairs to go anywhere because I just don't have the materials. I'm just at a, to <laughs> at a total standstill. <laughs> oh. There's, like, the odd tree here and there that I have access to. Um, yeah, we can't get over there. Can't get up there right now. Nothing over here. We got two, like a couple tree, like three trees here I could probably grab, but that's about it. Um, waiting for crops to crow is such a brutal lesson to learn. Just sitting and thinking about how you should have planted ahead. Oh, ex that is exactly what it is. It, exactly. Just like, ah, this should have been fine, but I wasn't paying enough attention to where everything's going and forgetting about how important trees are in tree farms. <laughs> the worst is that a bunch of these died. We're at 85%. 
And there goes that giant chunk. Although, yeah, these will be fine for 15, yeah, for 16 days, and the drought isn't lasting that long. Uh, so we should be fine on that front. So let's just open these up then. Uh, this one, yeah, this can be at a 0.5. Because we want more water going into here for when this all eventually gets built out. The better question is, is this water going to last for 12 days? <laughs> I certainly hope so. Oh, great. They're only just focused on carrots again. Um, your focus is nothing. Well, your focus is potato. Um, you berries are totally full right now, so we're just going to pause that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm just going to pause these two houses for right now. And how's this one? Plus another three. Okay, well, let's pause that one. Okay. Because I don't, I don't want too many showing up when we're still getting things back up and running. Oh, we got some trees coming in. Let's go. Finally. <laughs> we got trees. Let's go. Trees. We got trees. Yeah. You make a good point, Lion. I, I really shouldn't just be putting all my eggs in one basket. Excuse me. I like the investment of the oak saplings, of oak trees, of when they get going. They take a while to start, but then once they do, if the patch is big enough, then it just like you just keep you get to the end of it and then the front of it starts growing and then you just keep going in a cycle. Um, that's generally what I was going for. Not the smartest of ideas, but. Okay. Okay, this side's getting uh is getting prepared. Let's see. Let's let's reevaluate that at low for a moment just so we can start getting gears cuz we need those gears. Big potatoes, excellent. So I got nine days on this drought. I do need another piece of storage. So let's go with this one. You store gears. Since it's right there. Let's put a stair here. Boop, boop, boop. There we go. This little something else. Okay, let's say this is a medium importance. Okay, now they should be working on that. I don't think I have any other construction projects on the go. Oh, look at all of that lovely wood. Oh, this is what I've been ho waiting for. I've been waiting for this to pop. <laughs> oh. 
I thought I I thought I had enough wood to get from the surrounding areas while this grew. Um, underestimating how bad I am with water storage. Because <laughs> the goal was like this was supposed to be full. Like this wasn't supposed to be empty yet. <laughs> now I do have backup water over here. Water is just like evaporating, which is part of part of what I'm where I'm losing it. I'm gonna say that you're neutral. Nice. Okay, so we got a nice little staircase going straight up here. Let's turn beaver power back on. These are medium important jobs. And let's get the storage container unlocked. Excellent. Now let's store. Now again, I still really want to flood this area, so I, I, I gotta think things through a little bit, do a little bit of planning. That's that is totally valid. I would agree with that. You know what? I'm going to put two here. We're going to flag them as high importance. And you are both going to be for water. Because I'm planning on putting some water collection up in this area. As well as just as well as like what we got down here. So it's not all just in one spot. Okay. Now, our demand is only 700 and some. Oh, sorry, um, 100 and some. Let's do... I want another lumber mill. And another gear factory. And for powering this sucker, actually, wait, I don't want this down here because I want f I want power to go down there. I almost forgot. So, oh, but then right because I wanted to connect it. Okay, well, power fan. Oh, that was, this part's too close, poop. Okay, that'll get those connected. getting all over engineered with this although I am going to move these to here that seems good also instead of that one instead of it being the gear shop first it should be the lumber mill first Oh, 
Well, I suppose it's because I don't have the two working at the moment. Okay, let's just go, let's not go too ham. Let's let let's. Oh, we got water going. Let's go. Okay, let's just eject this. I'm gonna prioritize by, for the haulers. See, if it wasn't for this beaver power, we'd have no we'd have nothing being produced right now. Okay. Water. Mm, this can be a lower priority. We can put this back up to a normal priority. Okay, we're still gathering those trees. We have run out of water. Um, we have two and a bit days left. I think we'll be okay. Beaver wellness. You know what? I don't have a medical bed for them yet. So let's do that. That's part of what I was going to put into this little area here. Since we have this, let's put in alternating medical bed and sharp tooth uh, sharp or tooth sharpening station uh, I got there in the end very good how are we doing here okay I only have one worker beaver at the moment let's make it two since we had a beaver looking for work Okay, they're starting to get a little thirsty. Which is a good reminder. Okay, now they're getting thirsty again. So let's tap into our emergency reserves over here. It's only for a day, but hey, a day keeping them hydrated is better than not hydrated, right? Okay. I do think I need another lumberjack, though. At least one. Why was this not a high priority job? Okay, let's also close. Let's lower that all the way. That's fine. That's fine. This one, uh, yeah, that one's 0.5. I said that was fine already. Let's lower that to 0.5. The drought ends. I'm still just going to be gathering water as long as I can. Okay, these ones are now done ski. We'll just let them get the water out of it. Okay. It dried up anyway. You know what? I'm just going to close this to encourage more water heading over this way. Excellent. Okay, the trees are getting revived, as are all the plants. It died. And die. <laughs> 
Oh, let's remember how the rest of the song goes. Okay, we'll pop that up to a 0.5. This gets to be brought back up to a 0.5, just cuz. Actually, does it really matter? Probably not. Excellent, okay. Okay, so I have completely redirected it, so it is now only going through here, but that does create a drought, like a, this problem. So that's why I open up this side. And there we go. Now all the water is flowing through nicely, and we have a nice little reserve here. Oh, and the bad water is approaching. Perfect. I love this already. Okay, so I'm not going to have these be synchronized. I'm going to have them rise up real good. Oops. I was wondering how, what would happen there. So water is still flowing through here, but I'm encouraging more of it to head this way. I do think I need more water again. Like more water collection, that is. Okay, let's pop that in there. Let's increase our builder beavers. Because our population is starting to climb back up again. Now I am gonna let's let it sit for a minute. Because I am a little concerned about our food situation since our crops died out. But we do have berry beaver back on the job. These are at 20%, which makes sense. Let's let's plant that patch of quicker growing pine okay everybody is nicely not thirsty though which is good and we are collecting water Gears are underway. Yes, you are correct. You know what? I should start doing that now. I should have been doing this sooner, actually, is um, building up my water reserves. So we're just going to close off everything. We're going to encourage the water to head into here so we can build up our supply. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Let's close this one off for now. To build up this reserve. which is being fed in by this. Now we will be opening it up in a minute. And actually at the same time. Very quickly. 
run your butts over here, please. Actually, wait, no, don't do that yet. I take that back. I changed my mind. I do want a double flood gate, but I'll worry about that in a bit. Uh, I need to start getting metal. So if I don't start collecting metal, nothing's going to happen. Okay, let a, let a little bit more into here. This is my whole point, is I'm trying to build up strategic reserves. Oops, wrong way. Okay, I think we can speed things up. Okay, open that up. That's closed. This is closed. I'm confirming that they're closed. This one's closed, and that's fine. See, it all worked back into the river. Excellent. And now, all the bad water should just head down this way. I mean, it's going to head over this way, too. Oh, shit. This ain't cool. This is why I wanted these to be too high, because otherwise this happens. It's also partly why I wanted to break this open. Let's then give me another little relief channel. Oh shit, I, I left that open way too long. I left that open way, way too long. Okay, well I'll just take in a bunch of this water then. Let's close that before it fl floods like it's about to. Okay, the bad water is primarily heading this way. I'm just gathering the runoff, basically. Okay, that's, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, making progress. Um, let's see. Let's take a set of stairs. Actually, no, not, not stairs. Um, I guess I should have demolished these. Just so they don't go into the bad water.
Okay. Oh wait, you can they could walk on those? That's I didn't know that. Okay, open up open up a little flood path there. There we go. Okay, now now the bad water has a second place to escape instead of over flooding into our little beaver dumb here. Much better. And then I'll just throw a floodgate in here for when there's a drought and I'm trying to save water. Although I do, I do want my double floodgate now. Perfect. Now all I need is a floodgate. Now it should just be a twofer right here. That should be enough to control this. Perfect. Like this is actually, you can see how this is working. We, there's less water on this side than on this side. Perfect. Nice. I'm not even worried about this area over here now. I think we need more farmers because I'm silly and had them under utilized. Okay, let's turn these on as well. Because, like, we got the crops coming in, it's all working. Harvesters are important. Okay, I'm going to say we need two as top, two as medium, and one as neutral. That's fine. These are medium jobs. Yep. Now we're, we're getting lots of planks, but I think I might be making too many planks. Although no one's working on this one, so it's fine. The real problem is that I don't have enough uh, wood coming in. Oh my goodness. Hey, Sock! Thank you, thank you. Much appreciated, my friend. Thank you for the lurk. Have a wonderful evening. I imagine that you're heading off to sleep or something. Because it is, it is a bit of a later time in the day. Why is that beaver just standing there instead of uh, cutting? Oh, because it's just outside the trim range. I see. Oh yeah, but these ones are popping now. Nice. Was that like the only one right here that's about to pop? Kind of looks like it. No worries. 
Oh, oh, sock. Ro, uh, you gotta DM me. We're we're planning a trip down uh, your your side of the border in a couple like uh, at some point soon. We got we got to figure out a meetup. Okay, let's let uh, some of this water into our basin here. Just a, just a little top up. Are they seriously just like outside your uh, range to cut? Also, ah, oh, that one didn't have anyone cutting. That explains the thing or five. Okay, so this one can cut here. This one can cut there. That one can't cut over here. <laughs> what the hell? Look at that. Look at all that bad water just going away. I kind of want to block off like up here so I don't have this like stagnant pool, but I'm not going to worry too much about it right now. Although I did low key mess up here. This I should have built this further this side because right here is where I need to put the two fur. It's waiting on a little more there. And this side's going to get the same treatment. Well, once again, I should have built this like one further back. I just did this very stupidly. Okay. I imagine they're going to go and deliver planks. Do I not have that tree? I don't have that tree flight for cutting. I was wondering why they weren't cutting. Okay, and I'm thinking, just because I can, let's plant all these, like, little green open patches. They're going to become areas for trees. Okay, so I can go out to here. Okay, that should be lots of trees, hopefully, now that I have a system for keeping it. Okay. There we go. I'll probably end up putting another one there just to get rid of that visual glitch. But this one, now I can fully lock that off so I don't have to worry about it contaminating. If there's like an overflow or something. Which is what was ju which is what was happening. That needs one more log, two more logs, and then this one's almost done. Needs all its logs, but that's okay. Let's see. Oh yeah, these ones are about to pop. Perfect. 
So those will be those pines that y'all suggested. Thank you, Lion and uh, Waltz, for those again. <laughs> Oh my, excuse me. Tree! We have tree. Well, how about all around here? Um, no, it looks like it was just one of those like random odd trees. That's fine. These will be done in the morning. last day of bad water we haven't run out of water yet it, it was more involved in paying attention but that's expected oh nice okay floodgate one is complete uh, make sure that that's just open all the way we don't need it uh, holding back any water right now They grow up so fast. Trees. Not bad. Okay, let's wait. We got we gotta wait for the bad water to go away, of course. Yeah. Um, I don't really have an active plug in here right now for that. But, uh, here. Over here. Welcome. Well, yeah, they just stick it over here or something. That's why I was trying to get you over this side. Because I didn't know if maybe you were actively trying to do something. Okay, we're going to open up that floodplain. Um, this seems fine enough to let through now. It has a little contaminated water, but the contaminated water is highly dilute. 0.5, so it only goes through one way. Now I'm waiting for this to kind of get rinsed out a bit more. Fantastic. Okay, this is gradually getting washed away. When this is like only a little bit left, I'll bring it back up. Okay. Hello. Oh, you know what I could do? I wonder how this would work. Is this going to cause it to get pushed out this way? That's what I'm hoping. Oh, don't, don't, don't get contaminated in bad water. Yeah, it's doing what I thought it would do. The water is indeed pushing up this way and down this way. Let's go. Okay, 
Yeah, we're safe. We're good. We are just full up on flour. So, how about we unlock the crit smith and the bakery? Okay, let's take a grit smith. That's kind of awesome. Now I don't need two, so I'm only gonna do one for now, but I have this little void waiting for the next thing. Uh, bakery. Now bakery doesn't use any power, so it can go basically anywhere. So let's have it pop over here for now. You're gonna make bread while you make wheat flour. Now I already have a spot for wheat flour to be stored. Perfect. Let's convert these from grilled potatoes to bread. Because I have these tiny containers here, right? Hey, hey, Saracil, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. Uh, underwater trees are worth it. Uh, they'll provide food uh, and wood. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I'm doing pretty okay. Working on our little village here, trying to keep them from dying. This This village was at one point reduced down to a population of four. Then we had a, then we started coming back and things were going good. And then we had another event that called uh, two thirds of the population and brought us down to 11. We're just about back to where we were. Actually, no, we are exactly back to where we were because we have now hit the beds that we had before. Okay, I need to start building up reserves. Oh, goodness. Hello? No. Hello? Why do you keep calling me about my warranty? I don't need it. Okay, and since drought is happening, we're going to close this off. Bring all the water into here, which means I should also close this off. No, this is Patrick. Okay, close that off. This filled up a lot faster than I was expecting, to be honest. Okay, close it back off again. And get this area filling up. <laughs> okay close that open that let's open this a little bit get some more water into this section okay Okay, perfect. Now I can go and get rid of these. Drought has started. 
Oh, I guess I could have just kept... You know what? I'm going to keep this close. What am I doing? What am I doing getting rid of all this extra water? This is just more water to funnel into here. Silly. Okay. Yeah, we're looking good. Now I do have the majority of the water on this side, but that's okay. That's what we wanted. That was the plan. And so far everything is going according to the plan. Perfect. Okay, let's take a uh, stilt like this and go boop boop. Because we're going to take a house and we're going to go boop and boop. Now, let's do the stilts first. Although I am, once again, waiting on um, wood, but this wood should finish growing pretty soon. Yeah, look at this. This oak wood is already at 95%, so that should be good to go fairly shortly. <coughs> love this game i just love the the beaver ass like it's so much good okay and look at all this water we have perfect Um, this is okay. So this only needs logs now, and then we have our grit smith. Nice. How are we doing over here? This also only needs logs, and then we have a bakery. So I'm gonna actually flag these two as top and uh, no, never mind. They can be regular importance. I take that back. I'm just waiting for these trees to finish growing like watch watch here it goes oh there oh yeah we got trees growing oh yeah oh heck yeah we love trees get oxygen hopefully this puts me in a good neutral position for this um, now I am also going to storage large pile, uh, right here, why not, is where we are then going to set up our metal scavenger. And guess what? This stores scrap metal. Okay. Yep, yeah, we got the trees coming along. Perfect. Of course they build the house first. To be fair, it only needed the planks, so or the logs, not no planks. These needed planks to get built. But this bed is all accessible, perfect. Off they go. Love watching the beavers just like run away. Of course you can't go in there. You need your stilt, silly. Okay. Let's refill our river, our, uh, yeah, our river here.
I like the tense music because there's a drought happening, but like, we're fine. <laughs> Ain't gotta worry about this. Um, I still miss a build on a block road from the house. Wait, what? Oh, I, I totally did. You're absolutely right. I just couldn't see it. Good catch, good catch. Thank you, thank you. Okay, and very soon they'll be able to live here. Perfect. Oh, we got a grit smith. Nice. Okay, let's bring somebody in here. Because that's going to make our wheat flour. And then we're going to use that and make bread. We got two medium tanks here full of water, which is really good. We've got lots of trees growing in now. Oh yeah, and we've got logs starting to build up. This is perfect. Uh, let's put a medium on this one so we can have someone start collecting that. I should work on moving my farm over here. That would be a smart thing. The above ground farm. Actually, wait. Instead of building on the farmland, what if I... Oh, yeah, perfect. Why don't I just put the farm on the unfarmable land? <laughs> There's an idea. Because then I can work on flooding this plane again. Which I've been saying from the beginning has been a has been part of my plan. So I should probably do some uh, move some of the storage of stuff. I guess I don't really need to. It'd just be nice to um, plant crops. Okay, so let's do some wheat. Now, I don't know if that's fertile, but I'm going to try. Uh, then we have potato. You know what? I'm going to do this bottom half here as potato. And then wheat can be like this top half. Possibly even some more over here. And then we got carrots. Although I feel like I should have more wheat than carrots, honestly. Okay, that seems good. Okay, so this area here is clearly too dry, but that's fine. Okay, so I'm just going to turn you off in favor of this one up here. I have you kind of gathering, but honestly, uh, we can just have you go up here as well. We'll just get rid of those. Okay, this is coming together. This right here is clearly not farmable, but that's fine. Oh, we went from eight to nine. Nice. 
I imagine it helps that I'm making uh, making this now. Although you know what? Uh, I'm actually gonna make this the wheat flour, and then this down here can become bread. Those can stay bread for now. That's fine. Oh, oh, it's been at such a standstill for so long waiting for wood. <laughs> oh, that's almost completely empty. Let's try and fill some more water into there. Now, I don't want to take all the water necessarily. That should be fine, honestly. Okay, let's open this up for when the water comes. Actually, no, wait, we want to keep this closed so I can get water back in here for when water comes back through. So let's reduce this down to 0.5. This can go down to 0.5. This can stay at a 1. Perfect. As it is, you can see that this is going to dry up real quick. Pretty sure even if I open this up all the way, it wouldn't let any water through right now. How am I doing on... Okay. Okay. At the end of the drought, we're going to replace this with the two. I'm not a fan of doing it this way, but it's kind of what I have to do. Stable logs is coming in. Maybe it's time to make something. I agree. I don't want to get too ahead of myself while we're in, in a drought that's about to see our water all go away. So I'm, I'm kind of playing it a little close to the vest right now. Although I am also working on getting this together. Okay, yeah, there's that gone. That's fine. Um, let's see if I... Nope, this still has water. Perfect. One thing I do need is a smelter. I need to start producing metals. And then I'm going to need a pile. I can just go kind of here for now, I guess. Metal. What else can we research? We can research some stuff. Uh, you know what we should do? We should work on paper. That seems like a good one. Okay, and there goes all that water. That's what I was afraid was going to happen, but at the same time, I'm going to break a carnal rule and destroy those first. Okay, those go there. Very high priority. I kind of, I wish I built that in its original spot, but that's fine as is, that's fine as is. Uh, this one needed to get moved further back. Well, I mean, it could have been built where I just destroyed this one, but it needed to go in one of those two spots, is what I'm saying. Okay. Oh, I also get it. Okay, I'll do that after. 
Yep, it all dried out. That's fine. This is less fine, but this is where we're at. Shift R. Uh, I'm I'm doing Shift R. I don't see it really doing anything. The shift seem to be it seems to be doing something. I'm confused. When I build the building, I can... Oh! Really? Shift R seems to just... Oh, it rotates it in the other direction. It's, it's counter-rotation. then F to flip where the door is, which is also really good to know. I should have done that before I did this here. You meant F. Okay, that's fair, that's fair. That's fair. Ah, that's a bad joke. Four beavers with nothing to do, eh? Okay, well, let's research a builder's hut. And then you can go off and build stuff. I just need a spot for it to go. So, yeah, whatever. It can go over here. Actually, no, I take that back. It can go over here since I can't do anything there anyway. Uh, let's have this be elevated. And put these on medium, just so that we get more builders more faster. Okay, the drought is over. Perfect. Let the water in. Let the water in. And let the water in. Perfect. Bunch of logs. Nice. Now for the plunks. Okay, have this be 0.5 for now. There is something else I need to do. Because once again, I'm going to be flooding this area. I might as well prepare accordingly. Paths. I keep forgetting where the stairs are for some reason. Destruction. Okay, perfect.
perfect. Just one more. <clears throat> we also got a bunch of that, which needs to be picked up. A drought. That's the last one. Perfect. Now they just need the beaver to come over and finish it off. Because these reach down two, so this will be fine. Oh, perfect. This is all done. How are we on wood? Okay, we got lots of wood still. That's perfect. Okay, I'm just going to close this off entirely, actually. Let's get this area flooding. Now, it makes these unavailable, but that's okay. I knew that was going to happen. If anything, that's why I'm building up those other ones you see. I figure I have enough water going that I might as well just get these built up now. Okay, well, I'll connect it there for now. Oh no, we can't reach our water. Give it a minute. It'd be cool if you could just like swim up to it though. I mean, you're beavers. Okay. So it's a drought, not bad water. So we want all of this to get as full as possible. This is kind of redundant now, um, but I'm going to keep it for now just in case because it doesn't hurt to have a backup supply. There we go. Oh, and now we have a little bit too much water. So let's let some of this through. And close it off because we are now in a drought. There we go. Look at this. L look at all of this water we now have. Yes, but I, I don't have the metal for it yet. Because you need metal in order to make the, uh, I think it's metal anyway. Um, oh, it's treated, pla it's treated planks, which I super don't have. I will be getting that, don't get me wrong. You're absolutely correct. I just haven't reached that point yet. Although now, I can do my aquatic farming, which is pretty awesome. We got regular farm up here. Oh yeah, we got lots of bread. We, oh, we got food. We got so much food. 
Now, berries are going to be a bit of a short supply, so I'm going to need to set up a berry production line. I want this to go here. Uh, this to unfortunately go like that. This to go like this. I also haven't built any new houses in a while. But so far we're doing pretty good. I'm going to do another quick BRB though. I'm gonna run back to the washroom. I return. Sorry about that. Just had to run to the washroom and then went to see how the wife is doing because she's about to head to bed. Um, if I unlock the bridge, you can cross um, the farm overhead. Oh, really? I've honestly never used the bridge. <laughs> and again, like those are expensive. <laughs> You see, I just wanted to connect it to hopefully make it a little bit better. It didn't do it. It didn't really do anything, though. Ugh. 
I'm curious, who else is playing this game? Because I'm also getting a little hungry. Well, I'm getting very hungry. My stomach's going gurgle gurgle and it's almost midnight for me. I started later than I usually do, but at the same time, this is also a pretty good time for me, if I'm honest, because I'm pretty awake. I can't be too early, I can't be too late. Oh, we got the metal producing now, that's good. We have, oh, I'm, I did really good with setting up this drought love protection just in time, because look at this, we have, this was a, I didn't realize this was a 22 day drought. <laughs> But it doesn't matter because all of it is coming through here. Ooh. I just realized if I open this up and this up and have it go through here, that could help later on, potentially. Just put like a little blocker here and have the water go boop doop doop doop. I'll have to explore that later. For now, we're fine. I'm actually really happy with where the state of things are right now. Um, we do need to get some more housing going. So let's do this smartly and build this out first. Very good. Then we take the house and we plop it down there. I'm trying not to go too big too fast, but at the same time, I think we're doing pretty darn good. As it is, this is I think the more water than we need right now. So let's plop that there and let's turn this into path before I forget because I will. <laughs> Oh, no, I don't want triples. Whoops. Doubles will be good enough for this. Because on top of these doubles, we are going to put down... Sometimes it's faster to just do that. Okay, so this area covers that one, and this one covers this side. Perfect! Okay, so on one side, we are going to basically farm uh, whatever this stuff is called. I always get it wrong. Okay, that looks good. And now on this side, we want the cattail. And how far up can I go? Up to here. Oh, not too far that way. Okay. That looks decent.
It'll obviously need some storage space, but I'll get to that eventually. No, this can go over here instead. Because you know what? I always forget. This can just go under here. Um, delete. Put down some more of that cat tail right here. What? Okay. No, I don't like that one there. That's too crowded. Okay, yeah, no one's working this one yet. That's fine. Well, you know what? I, I do have a bunch of baby uh, beavers about to grow up. So how about I, I, I give them a minute to do that. Oh, this is perfect. Logs for days. Yeah, and see, we're, we've hit that critical mass where these ones will finish uh, growing before like the end ones can really be harvested. That's what I was aiming for. Perfect. How are y'all thirsty? I get there's a drought going on, but you wouldn't know it being in our little village. You silly gooses. That's fair. I was just looking at uh, who else is doing Timberborn right now so I can do a raid, but the only other person currently playing it is, uh, I mean, there is someone else playing it, but they're just currently, it's a French streamer, which is awesome and cool. Parlez-vous Francais? No, not, not well. I, I don't remember anything uh, since grade nine when I stopped having to take French. Uh, much to my mom's uh, dis uh, dismay, since my mom uh, taught, uh, would teach French. <laughs> Wheat, it died, it died. Um, okay. Well, I guess I'll just leave it with that then. I was looking to, looking to pass on the the raid love since we got a couple of raids earlier. I feel bad if I get raided and then don't raid. <laughs> so we have nine days of drought left and it looks like this top level might go down we'll see how that goes but hello hello what map is this i am doing lakes that was the the name of the map on like the top <laughs> You enjoy Timberborn, my friend? 
Uh, I'm really bad with names. I'm really sorry. Uh, Bummy? Is that is that remotely close? I'm very sorry. Okay, we haven't had a bad water. We've had like one bad water. We haven't had one in quite a while, which is kind of awesome. We're getting a metal surplus, so we, we, we will have enough soon to start working on things like TNT. You know what, I'm even just going to unlock uh, the dynamite real quick. Yee. It's one you haven't played? Nice! It's one, uh, because I always did the first one, like the one that you start with usually. Uh, but I wanted to change it up and do a bit of a different map, which is where we are. It's definitely a lot uh, tighter to work in. This area here um, was where I had the village before. It's where you start. But I wanted to, oh, excuse me, I wanted to flood it in order to have more water reserves, more tree planting area. Up here is where I moved my crops to because the crops used to be down here. Okay, perfect. Our beavers have grown up. They're all looking for work now. That's what I was hoping for. There we go. We have our spatic or spatter dock and our cattail getting planted. Now I'm going to need to store it. Um, whereabouts do I feel like putting this? Um, I don't know. I don't know if they went to uh, Unreal 5. That's a good question. I know, like, there was a pretty big update, uh, a major update that did happen. I don't know if it was um, to Unreal 5 or not. I'd have to look. I mean, we can, just, we can just check right here. Uh, let's see. Build a map contest. That's cool. Um, update 5 progress. Oh, wait. Do you mean update 5 or Unreal 5? <laughs> I just real that, uh, realized that this has an update 5. And that was my mistake. That's back in November. I feel like I'm in update 5. I might be wrong. Oh, check out the status of update 5. Yeah, so update 5 must not be out yet. I am playing in the experimental branch, so if that contains some of 5. Oh yeah, look at how low that water is going. This is definitely going to run out of water before it unhydrates. That's what I'm choosing to call uh, lack of water, unhydrate. Oh, no, there are, there are, yeah, this is a bad water source right here. And we got uh, bad water chilling over here. We got, this is a bad water source. And we do have the bad tides come through every so often. So, yes, this does include, I'm guessing that that's part of update five. It changes so many of the recipes like I wasn't that I was not prepared for. <laughs> Which was it was my own fault. No, nothing else to say but that. Um, this needs metal for the large tank and it's 30, which isn't bad. We got 30 blocks right here. Do I uh, get a large tank going? We're doing pretty good on gears and stuff. Now the only problem is that there isn't really the space in how I've constructed this for it to go. Uh, however, it can just go right here. So let's destroy those. And in its place... 600 points? Yeah, we can afford that. Oops. Get rid of that last tree. There we go. Okay, fill this with water. 
should pretty much be like an instant build. <laughs> No worries, no worries. I haven't been in the areas that had the bad water, right? So, like, why would you suspect that? Okay, let's have this get ejected into our large water tank. Perfect. And I built all these along this river here, so even if the top layer we lose water, uh, we'll still be able to, like just now, we'll still be able to get water. Okay. Oh, sh mm, you know, I shouldn't have done that. I'm putting those back because I'm going to need to eventually store up things like maple syrup and um, the antidote, which I don't have at the moment, but I will. <laughs> yeah, we're like totally set on wood right now. Okay, perfect. Uh, let that go while I figure out what I want to do next. Okay, I can open this back up to 1.5. That can stay closed. And this one stays closed. Perfect. I think it's good to have just in case... Um, it makes the beds more effective if you have the herbalist and the antidote together. It makes the medical beds way more effective uh, when injuries start to happen. And the more high-level stuff that gets introduced, like the smelting and whatnot, uh, the more likely they are to be injured. Um, at least, I think that's how that works. I could be wrong. <laughs> I'm probably wrong. Oh good, they're collecting the carrots. Oh my goodness. Hey, Crash, thank you, thank you for the raid. I was not expecting that, it made me jump. <laughs> welcome on in everybody, welcome, welcome. Well, let's get us a shout out here for Crash. Oh, my caps lock was on, oops. Make sure I spell your name right. I think I did, did I do it right? I did. Dylan, we got? You son of a bitch. Wait. Oh, you got some like, Starfield uh, going? Go. Let's go. Uh, ow! It stuck my <laughs> oh, I tried to slide my chair back. Son of a bitch. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I tried to slide my chair back to show my awesome muscles. I just stubbed my fucking toe. The awesome son muscles. I mean, you know, sometimes you got to pay for it. I mask my chair rolls on. I, put my I, fi I figured it wasn't Starfield on tonight. It's just Starfield in the clip. <laughs> Poor toe. Hey, Knives, how oh. you doing? Welcome, welcome. I swear that's worse than having your toes cut off. <laughs> ah. Okay. <laughs> Oh, I'm doing pretty good. Can't complain. We we were starting to kind of wind down a little bit because it's getting late. And then Mr. Coming in here with, with their raid of awesomeness. <laughs> How was Lethal Company? Did you did you manage to evade the the monsters plenty? Um the the freaking um uh, what what is it? The um the coil the spring head, the coil head. It's it, it's a it's a weeping angel. <laughs> You were harassed by a little girl. <laughs> you ran into them all? Oh no! You dodged the coil head? Nice. 
That thing is scary. I I was like, ah, I'd like I wasn't prepared the first time I went in, right? Because I I I didn't know what the game was about. I I my friend uh they got they got me the game. We went to play it. We're we're gonna be playing it tomorrow probably. Um, I'll, I'll probably stream it tomorrow, honestly, if we do end up playing it. <laughs> That's awesome, though. How'd you enjoy it? How was the games? We are here playing Timberborn. For those unfamiliar with Timberborn, it is... It, it's, um, if you're familiar with, like, City Skylines, um, SimCity, those kind of, like, city builder kind of games... That's what we got going here. It's a city builder where the people that you are managing and taking care of are beavers. Who doesn't love beavers? Oh yeah, look, look at them going to work. I saw, I saw this one here. They have a, a thing on their back. Yeah, see, they're going along. They're, they're going to work. They're, they're hauling, hauling materials along. And just now we were dealing with a drought because there's natural disasters and stuff that happen. And a drought is the worst thing for beavers. Beavers hate drought. But the drought just ended. So we've got water coming back in. We have our floodgate here. So we did manage to uh, keep enough water to keep us afloat. Now we just want this water to come back in and rejuvenate, bring life back into our surroundings. Lethal Company is a fun time. Are you running any mods with it? Uh, there's a handful of mods that uh, we found when we were playing it that we found really useful. Um, different suits, of course, but um, there's one for like a dedicated slot for the walkie-talkie and the... Um, uh, flashlight. Those are really helpful. You're using a handful? Nice. <clears throat> they died of old age, but then a new one was born. From the ashes rise the new. Mm hmm We have that one, too. That's a good one. Oh, there we go. Getting all of this water. Once it starts running out the back here, we'll be good. This part here is pretty redundant now. I don't really need that floodgate anymore, but still good to have. Ah, perfect. Giving us all the water. Yeah, we don't need those, so I'm just going to destroy them in favor of picking them up later. Um, right, I don't, I'm not storing these things yet. Uh, granted, I mean, we're not really growing them uh, fully as of yet, but still a good thing to do. Okay, I, I think it's good. We can open this floodgate now. Uh, someone play this where they have a nuclear fallout season occur and uh, create beaver, uh, zombie beavers. No, oh, that's awesome. <laughs> I want zombie beavers. <laughs> I don't, in this one, um, we are currently playing as the folktale beavers. Um, where they're not quite as industrious as the Iron Teeth Beavers. The Iron Teeth Beavers, those ones, like, they, they're not, like, they're more destructive to the environment. Uh, folk Tales, like, this is part of the lore of the game. The Folk Tales are very more in touch with nature, uh, and whatnot. <laughs> 
Also, I think I should be, but if I'm not, I gotta check something. What the hell? Okay. Sorry, Crash. I thought I was followed. I apparently was not, because I just now when I was getting ready to wrap up, I was looking for people to raid and I didn't see you. I swear I followed you because I've been in your chat. I don't know what happened, but okay, we it, I fixed it now. I'm sorry about that. It's my bad. Very good. Everything's in a good state of balance right now. But we don't necessarily want balance. We want to be pushing the envelope. But to make envelopes, you need paper. <laughs> okay, before I build that, we are going to build a power T-joint right there. Perfect. Give that top billing, then go into wood. Give us a paper mill that can go there. Excellent. Okay. Oh, we got bad tide approaching. Per okay, we have not had bad tide in forever, and I've actually been waiting for it. Because if I go to the water collection, if I make a bad water pump, I'm going to put those two there. Oops, didn't need that there. That's fine. Water. Uh, no, not water. Storage. Medium tank. I mean, I could use a big tank. It doesn't matter. No, I'm going to use a medium tank. This is going to be bad water. Because you, you need bad water to make bombs. To make things explode in for the dynamite. You need, you need that. Okay. Nice. Okay, you store paper. Where is paper? Uh, right there. There it is. Let's put that there and then a storage bin right there on top. Perfect. And then I'm thinking, let's put this here. Uh, that goes there. This can go across like that. I have a reason for doing this. I'm going to put another storage container on top, just facing out this way. Oh, no worries, knife. The knives have a fantastic sleep. Thank you. Thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you for being awesome. Okay, you store. Um, I don't quite know yet. Oh wait, I know what I know what goes in here. Okay. In here goes the cattail. And in here goes the spatter dock. Perfect. This is coming together nicely. Oh, sh oh, shit. I forgot about the bad tide.
I completely forgot about the bad tide. Let's build up our water reserve, which thankfully is actually pretty easy to do right now, even with the bad water coming in. I almost forgot to close that to make collecting the water even possible. Okay, so this is the bad water. Now we don't want to collect it. So I'm going to be closing it off before it can get into here. And then we're going to open that up again. And then same deal. I'm letting in as much water as I can before closing that off. And then opening this overflow. So that all the bad water goes around my base, but doesn't affect the beavers. Okay, perfect. And we have our water secured. It's not as much as I would have liked, but it's only for 10 days. So that's not the worst. Perfect. And now we're collecting bad water here to eventually get used to make bombs. Um, now I am going to put in a large water, a large tank here to hold the bad water. Not bad. Uh, in fact, just looking at this real quick, let's take um, stairs, put them here, here. Are we on metal? Yeah, okay, we'll be fine. This is pretty good. I'm pretty I'm pretty happy with where this is heading right now. Bad water's being collected. Gonna make some bombs. Because then I can like flatten out this area, make this a bit more usable, get flatten this part here, get more usability out of this. TNT's an important thing. And why are y'all thirsty and hungry? I have all of the food, all of the drink. Use it. <laughs> How weird. Very good. Okay, just a couple more gears. How are we on gears? I have no gears right now. Okay. I used them all up. This is probably my favorite like little nook where we're storing bread down here. It's just like this little thing surrounded by trees. You just pop down. It's this would just be like a cool place to sit down and have like a picnic or something, I feel. I don't know why, but this is what that feels like to me. Perfect. We're finally growing and gathering the 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 um, waterlogged food. Just a couple more gears. So I probably should make a second gear factory, you know? 
It has been a bit since I've built a second one. Hmm. Not the biggest fan of this being here like this. But I kind of did it to myself when I put the wheat flower here. Because originally it was, it was going to go like here. But it can go here. That's fine. Total. Okay, yeah, we're still good on power production somehow. More gears. Perfect. Maybe adding some, uh, <laughs> some well-being for them. Oh, you know what? That's a good idea. <laughs> I always forget the well-being stuff. Um, okay, let's just go down and unlock a couple of these. Um, the li the Lido, Lido, what, however you pronounce that. A dance hall? That's cool. Oh, and I can afford it. So you know what? We're, we're, we're gonna get, we're gonna get a dance. Oh, no, it needs Street of Planks. Never mind, we're not gonna get it yet. We're not gonna get it yet. We don't need that just yet. Um, okay, rooftop terrace. Must be built on a roof, and there we go. I don't have a good way for them to go up here. Wait, yes, I do. Right here. Because this whole thing could actually just come forward one, but that's fine. Um, stairs. Well, I guess I can go up either way. Then, more rooftop terraces. Hmm, can only make one up here. That's unfortunate. Just hoping to get a second. So I'll just have it feed in directly like that. Okay, let's do the... Um, I don't have any shrines set up currently. Let's put some of them here in that empty space. Um, let's have these get cut down. Let's do some more shrines right here. Well, I can do them up here too. Like more more places for them to to do what they want. You know what? I've somewhat changed my mind. Let's do... Um, I wish I could just hit delete on it sometimes.
Nice. There we go. I'm thinking let's just do this again. Give them another one. I can also make some showers. Hey, hey, Kevin. How you doing? I hope you're doing well, my friend. Okay, so now I need... Now, as if memory serves, it's two out, correct? Oh, but only one, it only needs to be one, okay. Because one of them needs to go into the, into the water. Also going to move this up. This is update five, uh, I'm told. We are currently experiencing a bad water cycle. So I'm taking the opportunity to harvest it. See, so yeah, we're actually in an active bad water cycle at the moment, not that you would necessarily know, which I find hilarious. Um, okay, I want uh, boop doop, well being. Shower. And then Lido. Well, give me that Lido again. Doing better. <coughs> okay, that goes there. Then I need a power connector going like that. And then you are going to be a grit smith. I mean, you already are a good smith, but I know what I mean. You're going to make cocktail flour. Then we're going to make another bakery. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the follow, Kevin. You just start playing update five. The bad water confused me. Oh, it confused the hell out of me, too. And I, I had the same problem where I was like, what do I do? And... It, it took me an embarrassingly long amount of time. Like, if you go back and watch, like, yesterday's stream, I promise you, it takes me an embarrassing long amount of time to think, oh, instead of just blocking off at the bottom, block at the top. Direct around. <laughs> I just didn't think of it. Now, to be fair, the map that I usually play on doesn't have this kind of option. I'm playing on a different map, so I'm, I'm learning a couple new things all at once. <laughs> which I love I love that there's new things being added to the game like honestly this game is just super well done <laughs> I have no notes okay that's why I probably have some notes I, I, I probably say some things here and there that I'm like oh, okay this would be nice here and, and whatnot but off the top of my head <laughs> Okay, so right now I'm kind of, I'm just rinsing off as much of the bad water as I can. It's also why I just pooled that right now, is so I can kind of just have it go whoosh. Okay, so that's going to keep going out that way. This isn't going to go anywhere until I open it up. So let's open these up.
I do have double floodgates blocking the bad water. Single floodgates would do, but then when the back pressure becomes too high and it risks flooding over, I don't want to contaminate my main area. So I made double floodgates to help prevent that. Okay, so now what I should be able to do... Because actually, if I look, I should have... Yeah, see, here's actually the leftovers, the ruins from... Um, initially, they were floodgate level ones. But the first time I had the bad water come through, um, I didn't have this section open. And it started getting pretty high and risked uh, going over and into my clean water. Um, it took a little bit, but I, I managed to make it work. <clears throat> okay, now we are going to close this off. So that we have only pressure going into here. And a little bit over here, so we can actually close that off for now. So yeah, I see these are only level 1s. Okay, so now all of I've channeled all the water, so it's all now going straight down in through here and down with this being the only outlet at the moment. Oh, I'm glad I'm doing this now because we have a drought approaching. Perfect. And so I need to be building up my uh, love my water anyway. So let's bring this up to a level two. And let's just fill in this whole area here. Now, if the bad water is diluted enough, it doesn't seem like it matters. Like, I have some bad water here, but it's getting mixed in so much that it just doesn't matter anymore. Oh, I got 10 beavers looking for jobs. Perfect. Okay, I got two days until everything comes to a head, which is good because I have a plan. So when, once this fills in and it's about to completely fill in, so I'm going to open this up, open this up, which is then going to cause the water to push out this way. So you see here it's pushing out because this is the main inlet and this is a main outlet. So even though I would, you'd think it would go this way, it's actually going to push this bad water up and out and down through here, which is what I was aiming for. It's part of why I didn't open that up. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing over here. I'm going to close this off and open this up to get rid of this little bit of bad water that's kicking around. Okay, now I'll close that. That can stay closed for now. Oh no, never mind. I take it back. That opens, that opens, that opens. Okay, let's open that. Let's close this. Since we're going into a drought and not bad water, it makes more sense to just collect as much water as I can, you know? <clears throat> now I'm trying not to flood everything, which is a very delicate balancing act. I think we're getting there. <laughs> I need to do some gravity power. I don't have a gravity uh, battery backup set up yet. I, d I have everything with a manual beaver backup. Uh, <laughs> it's better than the nothing, though. So at least these are doing something, you know? Um... Oh, shoot, I don't have a spot to store it. Um, okay. <coughs> um, I'm going to get rid of this one for now. I'm sorry, friends. I'll build you another one, I promise. In fact, here. Here's where I'm going to do it. I'm going to fulfill that promise right now. Why didn't I just build this up here, you're going to ask? Well, it's because um, I didn't think about it. Shut up. 
<laughs> and you know what? Here, I'm, I'm going to put one right here. How is that going to work, you ask? Easy. I'm going to put this here. This here. And this here. And that there. Okay. You store the flower that that makes. Oops, no, not the roots, the flower. Okay, the drought has begun. Am I, where am I losing water? Why am I losing water? Am I losing water somewhere? It feels like I'm losing water. Why does this seem really low? That did not balance out like I thought it would. What the hell? Cause like, that's not an outlet. That's just still an inlet. So where was all of my water going just now? Ooh, and we got a really big drought too. I don't... I'm a little confused, but whatever. Okay, I think this is all just like one level now, so I might as well just have it open. Because this is all feeding into this area, so. And on a 30 day drought, like, I'm so confused. Like, I had so much more water than this a minute ago. Oh well, I guess. Okay, we got flour getting made. That stores paper, that stores the flour, perfect. Um, I'm going to move the bakeries. Because now there's going to be two bakeries. You make bread, you make crackers. Okay, and you store the crackers. Perfect. Um, these are both going to be medium importance since they're about food. Um, I am going to need another house. So it can go there. Uh, a one by one uh, under the empty space of the platform. Yeah, I could. You're absolutely correct. I also said I wanted to start doing dynamite. Okay, now, um, I suppose this can be this is where I'm going to store the bombs. There we go. Now this one is not medium importance or anything, so I'm going to let that just be as is. Level 13, let's go!
Level 14. I can start working on uh, treated wood as well. Wouldn't be a bad idea. How are we on gears? I only have 19 gears though, so I'm going I'm going to wait. I'm, I need to let the beaver population increase uh, to handle these jobs. So let's get another house going for now. Also, you know what I just realized? Put this here. Sorry, friends, that one has to go. When it's okay, I'll put it right back. There we go. Select the path on top, please. giving them a bunch of terraces mostly because I can also wait did the terrace have a selection for fl I didn't check no I didn't think so there we go near rooftop terrace you could just but I could yeah no you're absolutely right I'm just choosing not to. I didn't like how that looked. I like that better. Okay, send them off to the races. I'm still very confused as to what the hell happened to all of my water, but... How much power are we using now? Well, when this kicks off, when this starts getting used, it's going to use more power, I'm sure. Shelter, more, yep, campfire, okay. I guess I can do some statues. Wait, these are monuments, right. A farmer monument. These help with things quite substantially, but... Beaver statue. Okay, I'm going to get rid of that shrine in favor of the statue to beefs. Although I'm also just noticing I can probably just do them here. I straight up never put down a campfire. 
Yo, we got iron teeth. Let's go. Put those over there for now. They're going to get moved. Should have put it where the water where the giant water tank is, but that's okay. Yeah, the water is too low for that. Which is part of my concern <laughs> of like where the hell did all that water go? Although it is 10 days later now, so because this was like a 30 day drought, so that's not that's not the worst, I guess. <clears throat> I'm not super stoked about it, but at the same time, it is what it is. Okay, with where this is heading, I'm a little worried that we might run out of water. So I am going to convert these back into water tanks. Because I'd rather be um, have more water in storage. And if we run out, then, then we'll survive. <laughs> okay, let's research large windmill. Since I have the stuff I need for that. Hmm. Now, I've built this in such a way that if I break them, it's going to be a bad time. So let's just break those two because that's not necessarily a bad time. And there we go. This one first, followed by this one second. And I have explosives getting made. Perfect. Explosion depth two. Oh, that's really cool. Oh wow, they were able to plant that corner one. I didn't realize that could happen. Yep, and there's that water drought I was worried about. But we still have water in here, so we're, we're still okay. Um, it could be better if you recover all the materials first before you lock off the windmill. I agree. But the idea is I'm going to open this whole area up in general, so... <clears throat> This will end up being accessible again, is, is basically what I'm getting at. Um, yeah, I'm just going to get rid of that for now. Oh, sh okay. Well, I have to destroy this windmill if I'm going to place this down, apparently. So I might as well just go for it. Yeah, that all dries out because it has to be submerged. Is that it for the dynamite? Am I out of explosives? 
Yes, but they, it is still getting power, though. So, I mean, that's not nothing. It needs a hell of a lot more power, because that's where most of the power consumption is going. Okay, well, let's get rid of this and this for now and put in the big windmills. Since those do fit and are going to produce more power. I went a little heavy. Okay. stairs please <coughs> there we go although you know what might work um The reason I did that is so that I can just have the power connector come down here like this. Although I can't fill that windmill yet because then I can't blow this up, so that has to happen first. <clears throat> okay. We are now producing more power than we need at the moment, which is excellent. Oh no! There's a beaver that is trapped! I'll save you, beaver! And you're free. <laughs> that actually worked. That's kind of hilarious. How are we on gears? We have no gears. Okay, so I gotta let that build up. I mean, we have seven gears here, but we have none in storage. a decent amount of bad water to go through. Oof. I think we might just be using the water that fast. Like, look, this is already almost empty. We do have a pretty big population now. Okay, well, I want to get rid of this whole level here, so I'm just going to mark the whole thing. There we go. Missed the spot. I also want to get rid of this. Okay. <clears throat> oh, and this too. Missed the spot. 
get this whole area flattened. Make it a bit nicer for me to work with. So I'll worry about that later. I'll let it keep working on the bombs and building its stuff up. Um, for when water comes back, yeah, that's closed. That's closed. Okay, I just want to make sure that when water comes back that we're able to fully capture it. Yeah, 10 days left. Like, after 10 days, we've almost used up all the water again. <laughs> At least we have, like, a stockpile of stuff now instead of before when we were kind of sitting on crap. Oh, yeah, are we ever going through water? Look, we're going through, like, a hundred at the end of the day. We got lots of food. So I'm not, I'm not worried about running out of food while this is happening. We have food to survive and our water will definitely survive us as well. So there was a little bit of bad water still mixed in there, but oh, it's all gone. It's interesting how it's able to keep track of that. That's really cool. But now we're officially in a total drought but so far, I'd say that's okay. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, I was waiting until I had enough gears to do this. Build the big fan there. It takes 30 gears, and we just got over 30. Oh, it's 20 gears. 30 paper. And I have a full thing of paper. How am I on planks? Okay, I'm at like 180 planks. 118 planks, sorry. Okay, I love it. Again, not enough power just now, but that's fine. Let's pop another one into the chain. All depends on how strong the wind is. This is also why I've got to get a gravity battery back up going at some point, but we'll worry about that later. As with everything. <laughs> I can turn on my two emergency uh, waters. You know what? Why not? I got beavers looking for work. I had, I destroyed this when uh, we had a scare with bad water. I didn't want our beavers accidentally going down into it. Because I had supplies over there that could be harvested. It's namely this. Excellent. Now I don't know if they're able to go and get it from there, so I'll just build... A little continuation path. Same goes for this. Perfect. They're going to go and pick up that crap. And we got water. It's not a lot of water. Oh, goodness, we've already gone through a whole thing of water. <laughs> um, okay, this is definitely a little scary. I think I'm going to need to build a couple more large uh, reservoirs.
How are we on power? Okay, that's not bad. This is almost max power outage. Or power output outage. I mean, outage! Outage! I, I'm not... I'm super wrong, but at the same time, am I? Yes. <laughs> um, let's put beaver statue in here, because why not? It's just lots of logs and planks. Gets me using the logs more, I guess. And now we have no power except for the power that we're getting from these guys. I love it when the wind kicks in in the evening and then dies in the, in the day. Okay, so this water is now empty as well. I'm glad I I'm glad I set those up as secondary uh, reservoirs. Had I not, I think that that would have been a bad time. Okay, this one's looking good. Power is what I wanted. For a second there, my brain went derp. Okay, just a little more power. I thought I'm tapping this out too. It's not getting me a lot, but hey, you know, it's it's getting me a little bit. Okay, seems like we're we're just doing old age now. Let's get us a what's the refine oh that makes fuel and stuff. Okay, I don't need that right now. Um oh but you need the extract to make the battery, I see. Observatory. Oh, I don't have any. Is that maple? Like, what? What is that? I think it's sap or something. Well, I don't have it yet, so I might as well get myself a tapper shack. And while I'm at it, I will unlock the wood workshop. Okay, so I want a single here, followed up by stair, stair. Might as well have a stair there just to make this a little more efficient. Then, uh, wood, not wood workshop, tapper shack. Pine resin. I am then, um, Mark all of this as low. In favor of right here. I should be able to get that part. <clears throat> okay, just two more gears, which I don't currently have. <laughs> 
I might need to make like more gear shops or something. How am I doing on planks? Uh, only okay. Building needs water. Yeah, that's fine. We'll have water in five days and we should be able to hold out until then. How are we doing food wise? Um, we still got lots of bread. Uh, let's see. Uh, we got lots of crackers. Where are my carrots? Do I even have carrots? I don't have any carrots in stock. They are all gone. I have berries. Um, my uh, baked potatoes are gone. The crackers are doing pretty well, but we got lots of flour that we're sitting on and lots of the base materials. So like, we're not running out anytime soon. Ooh, and we also have the spatic here that I could also grill up. That is a grill food, right? No, did it get moved? Um, let's see. Uh, bakery, gritsmith, and grill. Uh, let's check the grill. Maybe it's a grill thing. Yeah, it's grilled spatic. Okay. Get rid of this tree, please. And then give me a stand. Actually, no, you know what? Let's let's put in that. I don't know what it's going to be, but I'll put that there. And that's going to go there. This is going to be the grilled spatic. And this one can also be grilled spatic. Why not? There we go. Now I have yet another food source that has emerged during a drought. <laughs> That's pretty silly. Blueberry bush. Yeah, we'll be fine. What do you mean you got nothing to do? It's right here. You can't get to it, can you? Yo, Config, how's it going? I hope it's going well. It's been a minute. I also just realized I'm not going to need that after I make this go boom. Now you will now you should be able to get there. Okay. Pine resin. I'm doing pretty good. Can't complain. I mean, I can't complain, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> It's going pretty good. We're doing uh, our beaver town here in Timberborn. Trying to... Uh, let's make this a bit more higher priority, please. Trying to survive this drought is what I was trying to say. Excuse me. Okay, yeah, these are done, so we're just going to pause those, get them out of there. Uh, perfect. 
detonate. Now I'm also doing this so that I have a spot to store the sap. Ah, uh, what can I say? It's all about having fun. <laughs> but what's what's uh, FN like? Five Five Nights, Five Nights at Freddy's, or is that something else I'm just unfamiliar with because I'm silly? <laughs> Fortnite. Honestly, I've never heard it abbreviated as FN. Um, I haven't. I'm not necessarily against it. I didn't, I wasn't into the build mode. I will say that like the whole build mode build while shooting, like that's really cool. And like the people who were able to do it was awesome. I couldn't, it wasn't my cup of tea. Um, the actual like battlegrounds, the battle royale, that kind of stuff. Like I loved PUBG, so like this, it, it was cool. <laughs> Okay, now I should be able to throw down a storage without blocking the path. And you are going to store pine resin. I haven't looked into it. I, I heard that it was a thing, but I haven't actually looked into it. I've, 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 like, I've just avoided it because it's, like, the meme to do. Um, but I might I might just have to check it out at some point. And that LEGO game mode does sound interesting, I won't lie. Okay, let's get our water together. Yeah, now, now y'all are getting thirsty because our water has run out. Which is understandable. But here comes the bringer of life. And we got an army of beavers standing by waiting to collect the water. Roger, roger. We are waiting to get the water. Okay, this is blocked. Okay, there we go. We've got some beavers already going to work, making use of the of the rejuvenated soil. And it's Fortnite. <laughs> okay, I'm hoping that we don't drown. Um, not drown. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try something that I think is a little crazy, but I think it's gonna work. Perfect. Cause now I can put another water storage. Shit. Um, oh, no, no, this will work. This is fine. Just don't put that there. Put it on the other side like I originally intended to. Perfect. Okay, there we go. That's better. Nice. Oh. I also went through and redid, like, all the channel point points. Uh, so everything, like everything, is way cheaper now. Just across the board, it's cheaper. That's why it was so much lower. This was this was sitting at one and a half. This wasn't at two. No wonder I lost so much water. It was just free flowing out the back of this ass. Ah! And we have another drought approaching. Okay. Let's close this off and start building up our reserves now.
I was really confused as to where why I was losing so much water. But that makes so much sense now. Uh, you store water. Okay, let's not synchronize this one and have it be a little lower and see what that does for like relieving this pressure. Under pressure. Okay, that's not enough pressure relief. What about uh, two of them? Still not enough. How about three of them opened up even more? Okay, okay, it liked that. I seem to be relieving enough pressure now. This one's going to go back up to a half. This one can also go to one and a half fold. That one stays at a full one. We'll see how that does. <coughs> Looks like too much. So let's open that one then. Okay, yeah, that's good. That's good. That's a good balance. I think. It seems like it, that should be enough. Mm, maybe not. Okay, fine. Three of them at one. We know that that's enough. At least it used to be. Open that up some more. The drought is incoming at the end of this day. So I don't want to be like completely gutting all my water. Almost. And this time we're going to make sure it closes. One of them was still open. That was almost absolutely dreadful. Oh my god, another one is still open! Okay, now I'm fine. Now I'm not losing water. Okay, just make sure we're closed everywhere. Yep, yep, yep. 21 day. That's not bad. We, we, will, we would have survived that no problem. But now we're going to survive it absolutely no problem. Okay, yeah, our water surplus is increasing. It's a little slow. It could arguably be a little bit faster. So you know what? I think it's time to start expanding these. Um, for the large water pump, I have enough points. Now, how big of a footprint does it take? Okay, so it's a it's a uh, three by three. Okay.
you know what? Oh, this is this is pretty awesome. Um, I need to remove this. Okay, get rid of this and this. I need this. Oh, I need the treated planks. Yeah, I didn't think I've put down a spot for this to go yet. Okay, so for now, let's just get rid of all of that. Uh, let's take this. Okay, let's go normal speed for a second. <clears throat> See where I want to potentially put this. There's not a whole lot of spots for me to really do it without it messing things up like crazy. They have a house problem? Who has a house problem? Oh, three of them are homeless? Why are three of them homeless? What the heck? Did I blow up a house? Okay, so I definitely did a stupid thing. Uh, hold on. Make these the priority. I'm always amazed at the order that they do these in. Now I want to be careful. Yep, these are indeed the ones I want to get rid of next. gonna go poop poop doop, poop I guess that's how it's gonna go okay if I blow that one then it should be able to get all these all of these no problem this one it wouldn't have been able to get before Let's go. Okay. Quick save. Blow it. There we go. Let's go. Now we can put in the hardwood treatment center actually i am going to move it up slightly like right there okie dokes Actually, it doesn't really matter which one gets blown up next. I was thinking of putting this there. Oh, right, but it needs to be a pile. 
I just remembered it's a pile, not a uh, storage area. So where do we want this pile to go? Uh, I guess right here is fine. Perfect. We got pine resin over here. Detonate that. I want a forester over here. Just for replanting, you know? I just kind of felt like putting that there like that. I had no reason otherwise. Ah, poop. Big old poopity poop poop. Okay. Now in this area, it is only going to be pine. Well, it's, I mean, I can make it other stuff, but how far up can you go? Oh, you can go all the way over there. Nice. I think I missed. Yeah, I missed. I missed a spot. You know what else should go in here real quick? Um, I need a lumberjack. It died. Okay, so I need to cut down the dead ones. Do I need to cut down the dead ones? I think I do. These are just temporary. Once I've gotten rid of all of the dead ones, I will then get rid of that lumberjack. Oh, perfect. Much better. Okay, hopefully that helps with water levels. And holy crap, will it ever. Honestly. Excuse me. There we go, getting four of these online instead. And even just one of them is like, pff, night and day. Nice. Also, don't forget, you can customize your avatars down at the bottom. Uh, somewhere on screen, you should see a little uh, stream avatars logo. Click into that and then you can customize your avatar using those fat coins that you're collecting. That's what that's part of what you can use them for is make your little dude your own little dude.
Let's see, what are these? Uh, Fountain of Joy um, requires water. Uh, interesting. Those are cool. Let's plop a beaver down here. Because why not? Now I am being a little aggressive by making this all of my water production, but this one's about to be finished, so I don't feel that bad. <laughs> yeah, like this is producing so much water, I freaking love it. It's going little by little, but we're getting there. Day with 13 and a half days left of the drought. Yeah, we're pulling down that water quite nicely. Excellent. They're doing their job clearing out the pine trees and planting up the new ones. Okay, now I'm a little concerned that if I open this area up that that's going to cause me some grief, but I think I think it'll be okay. I mean, there is there is a, a exit over here. So if I opened this up, then I would have to come over here and build up a levee or something first. Just to get some more water on this side for these trees. Although apparently these trees are being watered. Wow. You know what? I've, I've somewhat changed my mind. I'm thinking this should be like half maple, half pine. But I can do maple over here now that I think about it How am I on bad water? Mm, I'm running out of bad water, which means I'm going to run out of explosives soon. Oh yeah, look at that. These two, two pumping stations are enough to keep uh, our beavers in plenty of water. We're already at a surplus with two. Like honestly, I don't even need three. I'm gonna build like I'm gonna build four, but <laughs> it is so surplus to requirements. Oh, perfect. Okay, I think we have collected all of the logs that we need from here. The hauling distance is pretty far. That's just, this was the closest to where I had the space at the time. It's not that bad. Um, although, you know what? I do have more people looking for work. So what if I did this? Nope, wrong one. Well, 
We'll just plop you down there. Actually, I'm gonna have it be here. Nope, there was supposed to be a path. Don't worry, I'm working on it. See, look, now I have three of these. Even with two of these, these were getting uh, super full, which I love. Okay, the water is getting a little low because of uh you can see the like when this shuts down we know the water is getting pretty low how are we doing on the so we have no spatic in reserves i might want to build another one of these for again the plant one for plant and one for gather Didn't have to be on that side, but I decided. There we go. We want the aquatic farmhouse. Okay. One is gathers on each of these sides. The other is plant on each of these sides. Uh, your focus is spatic. Your focus is cattail. Hey, guess what? Your focus is entirely gathered now. I better not see you planting. Okay. Uh, where is my builder hut? I have one up here. Get rid of that real quick. Um... Although it doesn't really matter. Shoot. I mean, I know I can just build more platforms, but I was trying to avoid platforms where possible. Oh, you know what? I actually built this platform over here that I then didn't use. Perfect. <laughs> Okay, these are all full of water. Those are full of water. We're all set. I'm out of logs. That's why nothing's happening. It's because I ran out of wood because we ran out of water here uh, twice in a row, which has stunted the growth of my trees again. Well, that's okay. We have a week left and look at all of this water we have. I'm just going to preemptively lower that to 1.5. I've still got tons of water in reserve up here. 
Like this is this is looking fantastic. And like I didn't realize that two of these was that strong. Three, I only really needed three. At least right now. If the population gets bigger, then the four would be fantastic, but we won't need that for a while, I think. Excuse me. Are these going to die? No, they got 10 days. We're fine. And we're out of the bad waters, so that was it for explosives for now. Well, I say that as they just proved me wrong and delivered an explosive, you assholes. <laughs> That's the end of the explosives for now. How are we looking power-wise? Uh, supply is... Not as high as it probably needs to be. Stairs. It's funny as I'm doing all this, but it's not going to matter until I get logs. But I might as well just get, you know, the rest of it placed for now, I guess. What are these? Oh, these are dead oak trees. Okay. Wait, what? How are these getting constructed? I thought I needed logs. Oh, they don't need logs! Yo, let's go! Now these need logs, and those can't be done until that's until I have enough of those, but... They only need one each. Heck, I could probably just break this and get that back. Did those take logs to build? Yes, they did. Maybe I should have waited. <laughs> Five days remaining in the drought. How am I still getting explosives? I thought I used up all my bad water. Okay, like maybe now I have. Like, what's going on? Okay, so this needs planks, which I am out of. And this one I'm sure is going to need all planks. Yep. In five days, we'll have our trees back. How are we on food wise? Still got lots of bread. Uh, crackers are going okay. The grilled spatic is non-existent. They love their grilled food. The grilled potatoes um, and the grilled spatic seem to be going like the fastest. Oh, I will be doing that. Usually, though, I'll just scale up with towers and whatnot because it's just easier. <laughs> that said, we're largely in a waiting game now, so I think this is... A good spot to wrap. I like how I said like two hours ago I was going to start getting ready to wrap up. And then what happened? I didn't. <laughs> but what can I say? It's because y'all are awesome that I wanted to keep going. Um, I will be back again, I guess, later today. 
uh, tomorrow, later today, um, in a couple hours to do probably some more of this. You know, we've been having a good time. We can do more of this. I might do some Fall Guys and uh, po possibly some Beat Saber mixed in there to get some exercise going. Uh, but yeah, it was lots of fun. It's always lots of fun. Big thank you for hanging out and being here. Huge thanks for the follows, for the raids that had like oh there was a lot that happened today y'all y'all are nuts and amazing <laughs> i will catch you here we're gonna we're actually gonna get some music going let's 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 play some outro chill music that was a lot louder than i expected i'm so sorry but on that note thank you again i will see you couple of hours i say a couple of hours it's gonna be like eight to ten hours until i come back on but you know gotta get some sleep i will see y'all i'll see y'all in a, in a after i after a nap i guess bye for now y'all are amazing hopefully it worked did it work Sorry, the credits were just breaking, and I don't know why. I think they might be working. Okay, we're good.
last second making a raid i just saw that uh luke around you also known as dark has gone live so i'm uh, sending you all over there stay awesome stay amazing have a great one they are playing lethal company Ooh.